today, I went on eBay and bought a ton of insanely rare Fortnite accounts. And I saved the best account for last, starting with... Today, I went on eBay and bought a $1 Fortnite account. But you guys won't believe it. It has the OG Skull Trooper on it. We are already equipped with this. This is actually going to be an insane locker review. Okay, let's just start it off with the pickaxes, guys. There's no way he already has the Skull Trooper, though. That is absolutely insane, boys. Okay, so starting it off, we got some Gaming Legend. We got some Icon as well. We got some Marvel series. Bro, this account is actually going to be insane. And I can't even believe I got this for $1. I just started the recording, guys, and I still can't believe it. Okay, so we got the Mako Glider here of Season 1. This was actually on eBay. It was a listing, and it said that it was a randomized Fortnite account. You had like a 1 in 20 chance of actually getting an OG account, and I actually got one. So I can't wait to see what's actually on this account, because it's going to be absolutely insane, boys. We got the Sir Glider the Brave and the Mako Glider, of course, as well. So again, those are pretty rare gliders. That is actually so dope that he has those, though. And the Get Down of Season 2, which is actually a Sparkle Specials exclusive glider. This goes with the Sparkle Specials, of course. We have the High Octane as well. You guys could obviously pause the video if you want to see the other gliders on this list, but yeah. I'm not really seeing anything else that cool. The Snowflake is pretty cool as well. He has, like, all the umbrellas, which is crazy. But yeah, let's just move on to the pickaxes. So if you guys don't know, the Minty Axe is one of my favorite pickaxes, and he already has that, and it's honestly really rare. Okay, starting it off, we got two DC. We got a Frozen Gaming Legend. We got an Icon as well. We got a few Marvel. We got a Shadow Series Shadow Slicer, which is actually pretty dope. We got a Sledgehammer two Star Wars series pickaxe. The ACDC is a season two exclusive, of course. Lading of Waning Moon. We got the Candy Axe, which is my favorite pickaxe in the game, if you guys don't know. We got the Chomp Jr. Crystal Axe of Masters. The Death Valley of season one. This actually did just re-release, so it's actually not too rare anymore, but yeah. I can't wait to see the skins on this account, boys, because it's gonna be absolutely insane, so please make sure you guys watch the whole video, because again, there's probably gonna be, like, the Renegade Raider on this account. I mean, why wouldn't there be? Because we have the Skull Trooper, so I, I bet there's gonna be something even more insane than the Skull Trooper, of course. We got the Merry Mint Axe, of course a very rare pickaxe let's see if he has anything else rare though so i'm not really seeing anything else too rare at the moment okay the axe caliber which is pretty rare actually this is a pretty rare pickaxe let's go the abominable axe as well not really rare but we're just gonna go through these blue pickaxes pretty quickly because again i want to rush to the skins because i know you guys are all waiting for it but yeah let's just see how crazy this count is actually gonna be because let me tell you guys it better be insane okay we got the peppermint pick we got the pop axe as well the pulse axe of season two the reaper of season Season one, Reliant Blades. The Ripe Rippers, the Sawtooth, the Shooting Star Staff. Okay, let's just keep going through these. The Specialist Pickaxe, Spike Bat, Star Wand as well. If you guys don't know, the Star Wand is actually a pretty sweaty pickaxe. The Studded Axe is also a very sweaty pickaxe. We got the Swell Striker, the Tat Axe, the Tenderizer. We also have the Tide Axes, the TNT, as well. Venom Blade, Wrenchers. We have the Banana Axe, so we are now in the Uncommon Pickaxes. Let's just go through these pretty quickly. I mean, there's nothing else really that cool in this account. I mean, I'm talking about pickaxes wise, but yeah, nothing else really that cool but we did have some season two pickaxes which is pretty dope look at all these really cool pickaxes so before we actually look at the skins i want to see all the emotes he actually has so he does have loads of emotes i want to see if he has any season two though so let's just look up season two and see what he has okay he has the floss emote which is probably one of the rarest emotes in the game if you guys didn't know he also has the ride the pony of season two this is one of my favorite emotes as well meaning he will have the worm emote the worm emote is actually so funny and like it's honestly slept on i feel like it's a pretty slept on season two emote and he also has the wave of season two another super dope emo the springy which is not from season two but chapter two season two we got some icon from season two as well okay let's get out of the season twos and let's see everything else he has okay, i'm gonna look for the fresh emo if he has that that is one of the rarest emotes in the game let's go he does actually have the fresh emo this hasn't came out in like 1500 days or some crazy thing like that yeah this emo does not came out in so long it's actually insane but yeah there are a few other emotes he has that are crazy rare again i'm not gonna go through every single one because that's gonna bore you guys out but yeah i'm gonna go through most of them we got the cluck strut the cat flip as well let's go we got the flipping incredible of season five nice the flipping sexy we have the flapper i'm not sure if the flapper is actually rare anymore it might be but yeah i'm not like 100 percent sure we got the sad bone from season nine i love this emote the flex on him emote this is awesome too the howl again there are probably some uncommons that are really rare like the kiss the cup i actually just got on one the kiss the cup is probably one of the rarest uncommon emotes but again there's like a lot of them that are pretty rare and i can't really name all of them again you can pause the video if you want waterworks 
used to be rare, but I'm pretty sure it came back in the shop, which I'm pretty upset about because I actually had it when it was rare. And yeah, it's back in the shop now, which is pretty annoying. The make it rain as well. I don't know if this is rare because I keep seeing like other make it make it emotes, if that makes sense, like in the shop and stuff. I'm not sure if this is actually rare though. We got the cyclo curl. This is a pretty cool emote. It's from chapter three, the electro shuffle of season one. So I'm going to filter it to season one to see what he has. Okay, the dab. We got some other ones here. We got the OG as well. The pokey ninja style. Okay, he does have loads of like icon and other set bundle emotes too, which is pretty dope, guys. This is a super stacked emote locker. All right, you know, one last thing before we look at the skins. Let's just see these back blings real quick, guys. Okay, so we'll get a little hint of what we're actually going to have on this account. Okay, so we got the Black Knight back bling. Let's go. This is extremely rare, boys. Not a lot of accounts have this, so it's pretty exclusive. Let's just see if he has any other rare back blings. Again, he will have the Skull Trooper back bling. We don't even need to look at it. I guess we can, though, for the memes. Okay, he does have it. Let's go, man. He also does have the Hamiras, which is pretty funny. I love this back bling just for the memes. This is pretty cool as well. Wow, I've never seen this. We got the Sinister Stocking pretty dope as well. So I'm not really sure like what backlings are actually that rare because I'm not really into backlings that much. But I know Squires are rare. I know the Black Knight's pretty rare. But yeah, you guys can pause the video if you guys want to check it out. We got the Spider Drone as well. We got some gaming. Okay, pretty dope, guys. The Fusion Orb really is sick though. This might be rare. I'm not 100% like, sure though. The Mutiny. Wow, look at this too. This is actually sick. What? Yeah, there really are some dope backlings here. Like I'm not even gonna lie. We got the Searfish as well. Wow, look at this, guys. This is so sick. What? All right, enough of this, guys. Guys, we're gonna go right into the skins. I know you guys have all been waiting for it. Let's just get right into it. All right, we got the DC Series Beast Boy. Okay, we got the Polar Belly. We got the Lara Croft. Okay, we got a few Icon. We got Cypher and Allie. Nice. We got a row and a half of Marvel. Okay, looking pretty good so far though. I just can't wait to see the OG skins. So you guys are just gonna have to watch till the end of the video. We got the Black Knight, man. This is the best thing we could see right now, honestly. So now we know. We can clarify that he'll have something else. We got the Dark Voyager of Season 3, the Enforcer, Eternal Night. We got the Fade as well. The Havoc of Season 3, Hybrid. We got the Love Ranger. The Omega of Season 4, fully maxed out as well. Let's go. This is a very dope skin. We got the Raptor, Red Knight, Ronin, Rose Team Leader, Sentinel, Snap, the Son of Goku. Nice. The Imagined, the Origin, which is a pretty dope skin. I actually really do like this skin. The Reaper of Season 3, another pretty rare skin. I love this skin as well. The Twin Valor, Warpaint, Wukong as well. He probably bought this back in Season 2. But again, guys, I cannot believe we got this account for $1. I, I just cannot fathom that, guys. $1 for this account, and we got all these OG skins. Again, guys, do not buy Fortnite accounts, but like, dang, man, that is just crazy. The Astra. Again, we did get very lucky, though. I'm not going to say that we didn't get lucky. Elite Agent of Season 3, let's go. Comment down below if you guys want me to keep buying Fortnite accounts, because I love making these videos. So let me know down below if you guys like these. The Itachi, John Cena, Jewels. We got the core Kuno Meow Skulls. Nice. We got the Mogul Master as well. The Moonwalker Nightlife. Nice. The Red Lion Rogue Agent, which is a season three skin. Pretty rare. The Rook Rust Lord Sabina. We got the Sky Snowfoot Storm Fader. Okay. We got the Sparkle Specialist of season two as well. Nice skin. This is pretty rare as well. The Ace, the Tilted Technique, the Tiantina. So we're getting down to the rare skins. Again, the blue skins. So that's going to let us know if he has any OGs. Again, he didn't have the goal, which is fine. But let's just see if he has the Ariel or the Renegade. Again, we did miss over the skull. Of course, we know he has it, guys. Okay, I am really hoping he'll have the Renegade or Ariel. The X-Lord, Yonder, Yule Trooper. But again, it's fine if he doesn't because we got this account for $1. I feel like I forget that sometimes, but we got this account for $1. The Baki Bandolette of Season 8. Nice. We got the Blizzabelle. Blue Squire, which is a Season 2 skin. Let's go. The Bright Bomber, Bronto. Nice. Romeo, another decently rare skin. The Diamond Diva, Double Cross. Okay, we got the Dynamo, which is pretty rare as well. Fishstick, Focus, Haze, The Hush. Iris, Journey vs. Hazard. Crisabelle, Laguna. Orin, Recon, Expert. Remedy vs. Toxin. The Royal Knight, Skull Ranger. Spark Plug, The Special Forces. I'm pretty sure The Special Forces is actually, like, extremely rare. There's no way he has this, bro. What? This is, like, top five rarest skins, bro. Wait, hold up, guys. I think this is, like, one of the rarest skins in the game. Yo, wait, no way, bro. I just realized that. Again, this skin hasn't been out in over a thousand thousand days no way bro oh my gosh that's actually insane bro oh i'm really happy with that one man dude i'm actually so hyped bro wait what dude no that's actually crazy bro tart tycoon is also 
pretty rare. The Assault Trooper Aura, Banner Trooper, Brainiac, Bullseye, Clash, the Crimson Scout Crystal, Desert Dominator, Garrison. Dude, I am really happy with that, guys. I'm not gonna lie. That's actually so sick, bro. He has that, man. Let's go, dude. We got the Recon Ranger, Red Jade, Renegade, Scarlet Commander, Star Spangled Ranger, Swing Sergeant, Whiplash, and to end off the locker tour, we got the World Warrior. Subscribe. See you guys tomorrow. Today, I went on eBay and bought the oldest account in the world. This account is absolutely insane, so let's just get right into it. So obviously, starting it off, we do have the Mako Glider, which is a Season 1 Glider. And again, this is the oldest account in the world, so this account is absolutely insane, boys. You guys should just watch till the end because it's absolutely insane. Okay, so obviously, we got the Mako Glider, which is probably one of the rarest gliders in the game. We also have the Get On Glider of Season 2, which is again an insanely rare glider. And I really do enjoy this glider. I think it is absolutely fire. And there are are a few more gliders and umbrellas he has like he has some of these season two umbrellas like the snowflake he also has the sir god of the brave of season two absolutely fire we also do have some marvel gliders we have some dark series gliders we have the blue streak which is actually a playstation exclusive glider this glider is actually pretty dope i honestly like it and oh he has the prismatic as well i love the prismatic glider i think this glider is actually so sick and again the sir god of the brave I, I think i showed you guys all these so we're gonna move on to the pickaxes okay pickaxes so i don't know how many pickaxes he actually has or how many rares he has but let's just see all right we got two icon we got a few marbles so obviously it's the oldest account in the world so we're not gonna have that many series pickaxes just because it's like the oldest account and you know the series came out in chapter two and up so obviously he won't have it so we got the acdc of season two okay honestly guys i don't know what his skins are looking like but he actually didn't say it in the ebay listing what skins he actually had so let's just see what he has at the end the bottom feeder we got the candy axe the candy axe is actually my favorite pickaxe in the game it is absolutely sick i love it we got the Eva pickaxe as well. I love this pickaxe. We also have the Permafrost of Season 5. Super dope. This goes with the Ragnarok, I'm pretty sure. We got the Axe Caliber of Season 2. Pretty dope. This is also a pretty rare pickaxe. We have the Batsicle as well. The Prawns. We got the Chill Axe. I actually really like the Chill Axe. I think it's a super clean pickaxe. Yeah, just looking at all these pickaxes, I could tell this account is extremely old. A lot of these are from Chapter 1. Like, I really haven't seen any Chapter 2. I mean, that's a Chapter 3, but really rare to see any Chapter 1 and off. We got the spectral axe we got the spike bat we also have the spiky of season one i really do like this pickaxe we got the widow's promise this is a chapter three season three okay pretty dope we also have the lucky of season one we got the mean streak old woody rose glow nice the tech axe tree splitter vendor tech elite and to end it off we have the default pickaxe okay we're gonna move on to the emotes now guys let's see all the rare emotes he has so obviously guys we're gonna start off by looking for the floss emote oh he has it let's go so the floss emote is one of my favorite emotes and of course it is one of the rarest in the game i'm pretty Pretty sure it is the rarest i'm not 100 sure but i think the fresh might be a little bit more rare but i'm not 100 percent. he also has the robot season three very clean emo the free flow flamencio nice we also got a loads of icon he has like around a row and a half which is honestly pretty rare we got the fancy feet the orange justice of season four nice so i'm looking for any other rares you guys could obviously pause the video if you want to see the rares the waterworks used to be rare but it's not actually rare anymore sadly the slow clap is season one okay a season one emo here so yeah you guys could obviously pause but i'm just gonna move on to the skins because i know you guys all want to see that you know what before the skins let's look at the back ones because why not okay he has the black shield of course guys we are gonna be wearing the black shield in this locker tour so we got the viper probe as well nice okay Let's just keep going through these. We got the Among Us crewmate back bling. I love this back bling. Oh, we got the Ghost Portal. No, I don't want to click edit style because I don't want to see if he actually has the Pearl variant. I want to wait till we're actually in the skin because I feel like that'll be so much more dope. We got the Hamiras as well. The Ice Cube. The Love Lock as well. Nice. Scales. I actually love this back bling just for like the memes. I think it's so cool, but I definitely wouldn't like wear this in a game, but I think it's dope. Wait, this is actually dope. What? I've never even seen this. What? This is sick. This will match the Slurp skin like so well. And there's there other styles oh there is other styles to it what bro wait this is so sick how do you even get this bro i actually want this oh we have the precision as well let's go the precision is like the most meme -y season three back bling you also have two squire shields yeah so i don't think there's anything else really in the back blings i should be looking at it's the frozen shroud as well yeah i kind of went through all the back blings oh and the love wings last one sorry guys okay you guys have been waiting for it we are going to move on to the skins obviously the skins are going to be absolutely insane i don't know what's on it but you know that's part of the fun we're gonna see what's on it maybe renegade raider maybe aerial 
maybe skull but yeah let's see these skins guys so obviously starting it off with skins he has the black knight which is a season two tier 100 skin actually it was tier 60 but yeah that was pretty much the tier 100 back in season two but yeah it's still extremely rare we got two icon series let's just start it off here we got two marvel as well we have the darth vader star wars set nice we also have the battle hound we have the black knight of season two nice again we knew he had this it is super dope though i love this skin we have the black heart calamity i want to see if he has any other ogs though like i can't wait to see these because imagine if he has any other ogs because he already has the black knight so the likelihood of us actually getting an og is like way higher all right we got the power cord ragnarok nice we have the raptor the raven the ronin okay i like this skin a lot it's actually a chapter three skin the rose team leader as well we have the ice king of season seven the imagined origin i really like the origin as well i'm pretty sure it's a chapter three skin i'm not sure what season oh season two snap okay it looks like he's been playing in chapter three but again i want to see his old skins because you know it is the oldest account in the world we have the vertex as well of season four nice we have the war paint wild card zenith he's the blue striker as well nice he has the dj yonder the dusk oh we also have the elite agent of season three nice the fable far out man he has the giddy up as well we have the gumbo what else do we got here we got the haven highland warrior huntress Kiara Ko, the mission specialist of season three nice he also has the moonwalker as well the onesie of season seven we have the plague the rogue agent as well the rook oh i've seen the skull trooper down here i hope it's the purple variant because then we know that it'll have more og skins and the skull trooper purple variant is like one of the rarest skins in the world so oh does he have it edit style Oh, he doesn't. Dang it, dude. You know, it's fine. I'm not going to get my hopes up. You know, he could still have OG skins. So I, I just hope he does. The Sledgehammer, Sparkle Specialist of Season 2. We have the Steel Sight, Sub Commander, Sun Strider, Sun Tan Specialist, Technique, the Ace. Come on, let's see if he has any OGs. We're getting down to the Aerial Assault slash Renegade Raider. Let's just hope he has it. I, I, I'm honestly trying not to get my hopes up here, but I really do hope he does have it. The Blue Squire of Season 2. Nice. We also have the Blue Team Leader, the Bright Bomber. So the Bright Bomber actually was my season three main i literally used to main this back in season three all the time i honestly thought it was a super dope skin back then too but honestly there's so many new skins out there that it's just not that good anymore but again it is a season three so we got the chopper as well the circuit breaker okay i'm pretty sure the circuit breaker is actually like extremely rare right now i'm not 100 sure but if you have it like let me know down below in the comments or if you want the circuit breaker like let me know because this skin is actually dope i think it's super underrated the major man cake oh i really like this skin as well i think it's super dope we have the poised playmaker the radiant striker the recon specialist oh he actually has the renegade raider let's go yo oh my gosh he didn't even tell me he had the renegade but he actually does have it bro let's go okay what well, the renegade raider guys is obviously the rarest skin in the game besides the aerial assault it is the rarest so technically it's the second rarest in the game but yeah this is literally like the most rare skin in the game dude let's go bro i'm actually so hyped right now so this actually could be like the oldest account in fortnite he said he started in season zero so so I, I'm honestly excited to see the rest of this. But I'm actually just happy he has the Renegade. That was literally like the only skin I was looking for. And the Aerial Assault. is the Royal Knight of Season 2. Another Season 2 exclusive. Nice. The Skull Ranger of Season 6. Okay, the Aura as well. We got the Foxy. We are down to the Uncommon Skins. We got the Nogops of Season 1. This actually used to be extremely rare, but it's not rare anymore. Pathfinder, Ranger, Renegade, Scorpion. And to end off the Locker Tour, we got the Whiplash. Oh my gosh, bro. There's no way. It's literally the rarest skin in the game bro oh my gosh i literally got this account for one dollar and i got the so in today's video we are going to be buying more fortnite accounts off of ebay guys like i say in almost all my other videos please do not actually buy fortnite accounts on ebay if you buy fortnite accounts on ebay you are literally setting yourself up to get scammed i've literally gotten scammed multiple times and it is just not worth it at all i only do these videos for entertainment purposes only so yeah guys i really wouldn't buy fortnite accounts on ebay before i start the video be sure to subscribe with all noties on literally less than half you guys who actually watch my videos are subscribed but yeah, just click the subscribe button guys. It is literally free. Okay, without further ado guys I'm gonna get right into the video. Okay guys, so we are now on ebay So we're just gonna search up fortnite accounts OG skins. Okay, guys, so I've been scrolling on eBay for about 20 minutes now, and I actually found some pretty cool Fortnite accounts to buy. So I found this account right here. It says stacked with OG skins, full access. As you guys can see right here, it shows the Black Knight skin, but it says it's $2,000. That is a little too overpriced for me, but I've seen in a lot of Fortnite accounts on eBay, the more expensive it is, the less likely you're gonna get scammed, just because, like, it's, it's more reasonable. I'm probably not gonna buy this account because this is way out of my budget. 
it. But yeah, I thought it was a pretty cool Fortnite account to show you guys. There's also one right under. It says Black Knight, Mako Glider, Glow Skin, 100 plus skins. Also some more OG skins. And it has 600 plus wins. So it's around $300. So in the picture right here, it doesn't even show the Black Knight. Which is extremely sketchy. And like, I kind of don't want to buy it after seeing that. So I'm probably not going to buy this one. But I'm going to keep this one on my mind. Okay, guys. So I found this Fortnite account. It says OG Skull Fortnite account. And it's $100. So for the OG Skull Tuber, I could literally get the OG Skull Tuber for $100. That is literally so cheap for the OG Skull Trooper. Like, the Skull Trooper runs at, like, $500. So, this is a really good deal, actually. But I'm sure that I could probably find something a little bit better. I kid you not, guys. I literally think I found the best Fortnite account ever. Bro, there's no way this isn't a scam. But it says OG Aerial Assault Trooper account. Insane skins and more. It says Black Knight and the Gold Trooper. Keep in mind, guys. I have literally never gotten the Aerial Assault Trooper ever in my whole entire times of buying Fortnite accounts on eBay. Like, this is my chance to literally get the Aerial Assault Trooper. I have never gotten it, guys. I've always wanted it. And if I actually got it in today's video, that would actually be unreal. I kind of want to risk it just for the video. But if I get scammed, I'm going to be pretty pissed. I'm not going to lie. All right, you know what, guys? I'm literally going to buy this account. I don't care if I get scammed. It's literally $1, dude. But if I get the Aerial Assault Trooper, I'm literally going to freak out, bro. That's actually insane, dude. All right, guys, I'm buying it right now. I will catch you when I'm in the locker. Okay, guys, so I am now logged into the Fortnite account. As you guys know, I bought this account for $1, guys. Literally $1, and I already see the Moonwalker skin equipped. And also, guys, if you see in the bottom left, he literally has the Battle Bus banner. And that is a Season 1 banner, guys. So that means that he might actually have the Aerial Assault Trooper. And guys, if he actually has this skin, I will literally freak out, dude. So to start off the locker tour, we are going to look at the pickaxes. Okay, he actually has a pretty nice amount of pickaxes. Okay, so we're going to start from the top. He has the Axe Trail Form, the Pry Axe, the Jaguar Strike, which is a pretty cool pickaxe. The Sap Axes, Party Animal, which is a Season 1 pickaxe. The Sludge Hammer, the ACDC, which is a Season 2 pickaxe. This was a few tiers away from the Black Knight skin. Let's go, dude. So that means that he probably has some more Season 2 skins. He has the Beast Fang, Burning Axe is a very cool pickaxe as well. Crystal Axe of Masters, Dragon's Claw. The Evo, which is a Season 3 pickaxe. Flawless, Fusion Scythe, Harmonic Axes, Ice Skepter, Mech Axe, Onslaught, Permafrost, The Reckoning, Rift Edge, which is a Season 5 pickaxe. Scorcher, Scratch Mark, Fire Flame, Swag Smasher. The Fret Basher, a very cool pickaxe as well. Trusty number 2, this is a Season 3 pickaxe. This matches with the John Wick skin of Season 3. The Vox, Marshy Smasher, Six Carat Cutter, Abominable Axe, Angler Axes, Arena Blessing, Axe Caliber, Balloon Axe, Bank Shots, Boulder Breakers, Bunker Basher, Sentry and Axe, Chainsaw, Chop Chop, Cliffhanger, Crowbar, Dive Knives, The Drummy is a very cool pickaxe as well, Frosty Glow. Globes, Gale Force, Gilded Glow, Highland Strikers, Josie, Kittens. He's a few more pickaxes, guys. I'm gonna go through a lot of these because he has so many. Oh, he has a Reaper as well, which is Skull Trooper pickaxe. Um, Salt Tooth, Shooting Star Staff. Guys, he has a few more. I'm kind of just gonna go through them. Oh, he's a Star Wand. This is a very sweaty pickaxe, in my opinion. Stud Axe, The Vision. He has a lot of sweaty pickaxes, guys. We're kind of getting to the bottom now. Oath and Sorrow, Palm Pummelers, Toe Pick, and the Default pickaxe. Okay, guys, so as you can tell, he already has a season. Season 2 pickaxe. The ACDC is an OG pickaxe, guys. So that is another clue that he might actually have the Aerial Assault Trooper. Guys, keep in mind, I've literally never gotten the Aerial Assault Trooper in all my accounts I've bought. I've literally always wanted it, guys. Like, you don't understand. So the moment of truth, guys, we are now gonna look at the skins. I know you guys have literally all been waiting for this. Let's just hope he has the Aerial Assault Trooper. Okay, so we're gonna do a quick little scroll. Oh, he actually has a pretty nice amount of skins. Okay, we're gonna start from the top. He's a Mandalorian. The aim. Oh, he has a Black Knight skin. Let's go. This is a season two skin, dude. Let's go, dude. This skin is so rare. The Black Heart. It's a pretty cool skin as well. Oh, he has a Calamity. Does he have all the styles of Calamity? He does. Let's go, dude. The Carbide. This is a season four skin. The Crack Shot. A very cool skin as well. It's a Christmas skin. The Dark Voyager. The Dyer, which is a nice skin as well. The Drift. The Enforcer. Fusion. Hybrid. The Joey skin. This is a very sick skin. I actually really like this skin. I never really see it in people's locks. So it's like kind of rare. Chimera, Lux, Lynx, Menace. Wow, this is super dope as well. I've never seen the fully maxed out Menace. Does he have Omega maxed out? Oh, he does. Let's go, dude. The Polarity. Oh, this is actually a pretty cool customization of it. The Ragnarok, which is a season five battle pass skin. The Raz, Rocks, the Ruin, Sentinel, Fear Assassin, Ice King, Prisoner. The Rebirth skin, which is a season three tier 
Wizard skin. Extremely rare as well. Visitor, Valor. This is Season 4 skin. The Vendetta, Zenith, Dark Bomber. The DC Series skin. The Gaming Legend Series skins as well. Always the Marshmallow skin. Icon Series skin. He's the whole Shadow Series set. 8-Ball versus Scratch. Ancient Jones. Alpine Ace. Blue Striker, which is a PS4 exclusive skin, I'm pretty sure. Bunker Jonesy. Cameo versus Chick. The Clock skin. Clutch. Demi, DJ Yonder, Dusk, Elite Agent, Ember, Fable, Field Surgeon, Gold Trooper. Does he have the OG style? No, he does not. That's kind of sketchy because he said he did have the OG style. I'm still praying that he'll have the Aerial Soul Trooper like he said, but I mean, it's not that big of a deal, honestly. I've gotten a lot of accounts with the OG goal, so I'm fine, honestly. The Giddy Up, Grimy, Grind, which is a basketball skin. Huntress. Oh, is the iconic skin? No way, dude. Dude, this skin is literally so rare. It's a Samsung exclusive skin let's go dude condor lexa evergreen mancake master key mave oh he's both of the mission specialists and the moonwalker skins nightshade night beam onesie peely such a meme skin guys i actually love this skin so much powder red line rust lord which is a season three skin this is a super nostalgic skin for me sergeant winter sidewinder sledgehammer sparkle specialist which is a super dope skin honestly guys i think this is my favorite season two skin it's literally like the best dude you just can't go wrong with this squad leader starfish a very cool skin as well i actually really like it stratus sunstrider technique the ace trog vega wild zoe ripley versus sludge absolute zero bro oh my gosh bro there's no way dude oh my gosh bro oh my gosh guys i've never gotten this skin ever dude this is literally the rarest skin in the game bro oh my gosh dude no way guys i literally got this account for one dollar and I got the aerial assault trooper, dude. Oh my gosh, dude. I'm actually freaking out, guys. Oh my gosh. Guys, literally in all of the accounts I've bought, I've never gotten this skin and I actually got it today. Guys, I'm actually freaking out. I've literally never gotten this skin. Oh my gosh, guys. Oh my gosh, guys. I need a breather. <laughs> Give me a second, guys. Oh my gosh. Okay, the beach bomber. Oh my gosh, dude. I can't believe that, dude. That's literally insane, dude. The clinical crosser, comfy chomps, diamond diva, journey versus hazard dude that's actually insane guys i can't believe it dude royal knight which is a season two skin spark plug Woolly warrior yoki birdie bolt we're on the screen skins now guys crystal light show nog ops recon ranger relay champion and the whiplash guys guys I, I can't believe i got the aerial assault trooper bro i can't even believe i'm looking at this right now dude the aerial assault trooper guys so in today's video we're gonna be buying more fortnite accounts off of ebay like i say in almost all my other videos please do not actually buy fortnite accounts on ebay guys like i'm telling you i've literally gotten scammed so many times so yeah it's really just not worth it guys because you'll most likely get scammed please don't actually buy fortnite accounts on ebay i do not condone this at all i am only doing this video for entertainment purposes only okay guys without further ado i'm gonna get right into the video okay guys so we are now on ebay so we're just gonna search up fortnite account og skins okay guys so i've been scrolling on ebay for about 20 minutes now and i actually found some pretty cool fortnite Fortnite accounts to buy. This one's coming in at around $90. It says Fortnite account, 150 skins, all console and full access. As you guys can see right here, it literally shows a Renegade Raider. So, I mean, $90 for the Renegade Raider is pretty good. I'm not going to lie. So, I'm going to keep my eye on this one. But we're still going to look because there's probably better deals out there. Oh, this one says Fortnite account, 170 skins, all console and full access. So, as you guys can see right here, he literally has three skins. So, as you guys can see, he does have the OG Gold Trooper. But he only has three skins. So, I don't really know if that's worth it, to be honest with you. But, yeah, I mean, $100 for the OG Gold Trooper is pretty good. I'm not going to lie. But, yeah, we're just going to keep looking, guys. Oh, my gosh. Look at this one. It says Fortnite OG account, 201 skins, exclusive skins, iconic, comes with Xbox account. Okay, for $200, it shows it has the iconic. I'm pretty sure this guy has more skins because he's only showing his favorited. But yeah, this might actually be a stacked account. This one is kind of a mystery account, so I'm probably not going to buy it. We'll probably save it for another day. Oh, wow. Look at this one, guys. Uh, Fortnite account, OG rare skin, and Black Knight for $500. Wait, actually, no. It's $1,000 to buy it right now. Guys, honestly, I think that's a little too overpriced. 
price. I definitely wouldn't buy this. It just, I don't, I don't think it's worth it. I mean, a thousand dollars for the Black Knight. That, that's just not worth it, guys. But yeah, we're just gonna keep looking, guys. Okay, guys. I literally think I found the perfect account. This one right here, guys. It says Black Knight account, Raiders Revenge pickaxe, and more OG cosmetics. It literally says 50 cents. In the picture, it shows the Renegade Raider. The guy says he has Raiders Revenge and Black Knight for 50 cents, bro. There's no way. This is just too good to be true. So we actually didn't say in the title that he had the Renegade Raider, but it's showing it in the picture. So there's no way he doesn't have it, but I'm really positive he has the Black Knight and the Raiders Revenge. You know what, boys? I've been thinking about this one. I'm actually gonna buy this 50 cent account. I mean, it kind of looks legit. Like, I don't know. Yeah, boys, I'm literally gonna buy it. I mean, who cares if I get scammed? I'm literally just gonna buy it now, guys. I'll just catch you when I get into the locker. Okay, guys, we are now in the Fortnite account. As you guys can see, he already had this equipped in his locker. So that means that he is a season three player, guys. As you guys know, the Reaper is a Season 3 Tier 100 skin. So that's actually crazy, guys. For 50 cents, we already got the Reaper skin. This skin is extremely rare, boys. To start off the locker tour, we are going to look at the pickaxes. Oh, wow. He actually has a pretty nice amount of pickaxes. Okay, we're going to start from the top. He has the DC Series pickaxes, pickaxe, a Shadow Slicer. He has the Sludge pickaxe. The ACDC, which is a Season 2 pickaxe, boys. The Beast Fang. Cosmic Llama Corn. This is a Chapter 2 pickaxe, I'm pretty sure. The Dragon's Claw. Eon Blade. Eva, which is a season three pickaxe, boys. The Ice Skeptor, it's the Ice King pickaxe. Onslaught, I really like this pickaxe as well. The Permafrost, Power Claws. Oh my gosh, bro, no way. Wait, guys, he literally has the Raider's Revenge pickaxe, bro. There's no way, dude. Yo, guys, if you guys don't know, this is literally the Renegade Raider pickaxe. As you guys know, he did say he had this on the eBay locker, but this is actually insane that I'm actually able to see this right now, dude. This is actually so rare, guys. Oh my gosh, boys, I'm actually so hype. Let's go. Imagine if he has the Renegade Raider too. That would actually be so hype. Reckoning, bro. There's no way he actually had that, dude. That's actually insane. The Rift Edge, Orcher, Scratch Mark, Swag Smasher, Trusty Number Two. This is a Reaper pickaxe. He had this equipped. Frozen Axe, Abominable Axe, Angler Axes, Excalibur. It's a Season Two pickaxe, boys. Balloon Axe, Boulder Breakers, Breathless Blades, Cosmic Cleavers, Dive Knots. I really like this pickaxe. Frosty Globes. Gale Force, Gilded Glow, Josie, Lockpick, Lollipopper, Lugax. He has a Medak, Null Claws. This is a Carbide Pickaxe. Pulse Act, Brilliant Blade, Sawtooth, Shooting Star Staff, Smash a Lantern, Smash Up, Snake Bite, Hide Axes, Victor's Frail, Vision Strikers, Wrenchers, Banana Axe, Oath and Sorrow, Throwback Axe, Toe Pick, and the Default Pickaxe, as usual. Okay, guys, as you can see, he doesn't have a crazy amount of pickaxes, but he is a very rare set of pickaxes, guys. He literally has the rarest pickaxe in the game and all the Season 2 pickaxes. Okay, boys, I know you guys have all been waiting for it. We are now gonna look at the skins. Okay, he is a decent amount of skins not as many as i was expecting but yeah we're just gonna start from the top boys i'm really hoping this guy will have the renegade raider oh he's the black knight skin let's go this is a season 2 tier 100 skin i was expecting this skin black heart calamity does he have all the styles to calamity he does have all the styles to calamity the carbide catalyst dark voyager this is a season 3 skin i think this is my favorite season 3 battle pass skin it's just so fire and it's so nostalgic i don't know the drift does he have all the styles to drift he does have every single style to drift let's go He's the Eternal Knight, Fade, Galaxy, Hybrid. Does he have all the styles of Hybrid? He does have all the styles of Hybrid as well. Love Ranger, Lynx. The Lynx is like honestly one of the best skins in the game as well. It's just so original, guys. And I don't know. It's just, it's just so, like you can't go wrong with the Lynx skin, guys. The Menace, Omega. I love the Omega skin as well. The Omega skin brings back a lot of memories for me. The Predator. This is a very big skin. I would definitely never wear it in game. The Ragnarok, Raven, Ice King, the Reaper. We already saw this in the locker the visitor valor zenith all the dc series skins he does actually he doesn't have all the dc series skins but he has a few of them ruby shadows Battlehawk, DJ Yonder, Dust, Elite Agent. This is a season three skin. If you guys don't know, this was like one of the sweatiest skins back in the day. This is like the beginning of the sweaty era in Fortnite. Like this skin right here. The Fable, season five skin. Giddy Up, Huntress, Duels, Hit, Condor, Lexa, Mancake, Mave, Mission Specialist. This is a season three skin. So is the Moonwalker. It's the same exact skin pretty much. Just a boy 
banana girl. Ocean. Onesie. Does he have the other style of onesie? Oh, he doesn't. So he doesn't have the other style of onesie, but honestly, I don't really care that much. It's not really a good skin anyway. He's a Peely. It's an awesome skin. Powder. Red line. I really like this skin as well. I used to main this back in season eight, I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was season eight. The Reese. Rook. The Rust Lord. This is a very nice skin as well. Gooba Jonesy. Sergeant Winter. Boys, I'm really hoping he'll have the Renegade Raider. Sparkle Specialist. Squad Leader. The Sun Strider. Technique. Tilted Technique. Trog. Wingman. X Lord. Zoe. I've really never really liked this skin, but it is the super nostalgic in for me. The Slurp skin. The Blue Squire, which is a season two skin. Extremely rare, boys. Cross Squad. Journey versus Hazard. Remedy. Royal Knight. Spark Plug. Riptide. Scarlet Defender. Whiplash. I'm gonna do one more double check to make sure he doesn't have the Renegade Raider or not. Yeah, boys, it doesn't look like he has the Renegade Raider, but honestly, like, I'm still happy with the account. You know what, guys? I think this is the rarest item on the account. Like, the Raider's Revenge Pickaxe is so insanely rare. Like, I I'm so, I'm still super happy about this, guys. Like, you can't, like, for 50 cents, I literally got the rarest pickaxe in the game. To check if he's actually an OG player, we're gonna look at the gliders and let's see if he has the Mako glider. As you guys know, the Mako glider is a season one glider. So, let's see if he has it. Mako glider, where are, there it is. Let's go. He has a Mako glider, which is a super rare glider, boys. It's a season one exclusive. Let's just take a look at all the dances he has as well, just to end off the video. Wow, guys, look at all these emotes he has, boys. Oh my gosh, man. He has to make it rain. Let's go, dude. Guys, he has a ton of emotes as well. Dude, there's no way he has this skin, bro. Oh my gosh, guys. I literally got this account for $1, dude. This is actually insane. Dude, there's no way he actually has the OG... Yo guys, so in today's video, we are going to be buying more Fortnite accounts off of eBay. As you guys know, buying Fortnite accounts on eBay is extremely sketchy, so I do not recommend it at all. So yes guys, please stay away from buying any Fortnite accounts on eBay. I'm only doing this video for entertainment purposes only. So before I start the video, be sure to subscribe with all noties on. Literally less than half of you guys who actually watch my videos are subscribed. So yeah, just click the subscribe button guys, it is literally free. Okay, without further ado, I'm going to get right into the video. Okay guys. So we are now on eBay. So we are just going to search up Fortnite mystery box accounts. Okay, guys. So I've been scrolling on eBay for about an hour now. And I actually found some pretty cool Fortnite accounts to buy. So I found this one right here. It's this stacked OG Fortnite account with max season three battle pass. And it's going to run about $137. So it has the season three battle pass. It has a ton more skins as well, as you guys could see. Honestly, this doesn't seem that worth it. But maybe I'll buy it in the future. But I honestly don't really like this account so there's one literally right under it it says fortnite og account black knight wildcat galaxy set mako glider and a hundred plus skins so guys it has the black knight guys the wildcat for 650 dollars honestly that's kind of mid price i mean it's okay it's a little on the pricier side but honestly like it's not too bad of a deal i'm gonna keep looking because there's obviously better accounts out there oh i found this account guys it says fortnite founder account og 50 plus skins og skins back bling glider account level 650 and it runs about 393 dollars so i don't even know if he has the og skull trooper because in the picture it doesn't even show the og skull trooper so honestly this account's kind of trash and i'm probably not gonna buy this one so there's the one literally under it it says fortnite account og skins it has 1200 v bucks so i don't really like this account either i was just scrolling and just trying to find other accounts this is way too overpriced for me guys okay guys so i wanted to show you this account that i literally just found it says fortnite mystery box account one in ten chance of getting OG skins. And it runs at about $1, guys. So, Fortnite Mystery Box account, obviously, guys. So there's a chance that I could actually get some OG skins. Honestly, guys, I think I'm gonna buy this just for the video. But if I get scammed, I'm honestly gonna be pretty pissed. So, yeah, guys, I'm gonna buy this account right now, and I'll catch you when I'm in the locker. Oh my gosh, guys, I'm literally in the Fortnite account right now, and I have the Black Knight skin equipped. Bro, there's no way. I literally just opened up this locker, and he had this skin out, dude. Oh my gosh, bro. And he also has a Mako glider, as you guys can see right here, dude. No way, dude. Oh my gosh. Dude, this account is already so stacked, and I didn't even look at the locker yet. So, to start off the locker review, guys, we are gonna look at the pickaxes. Okay, he actually has a pretty nice amount of pickaxes. Okay, he doesn't have a ton of pickaxes, but he has a decent amount. So, he has the Dark Axe, the Diamond Jack, which is a Icon Series pickaxe, all the Marvel Series pickaxes, 
pickaxes, which is pretty cool. The party animal. The ACDC, which is a season two pickaxe. This was 100% expected because he had the Black Knight skin. The candy axe. I actually love this pickaxe. The Chomp Jr., Death Valley, Dual Edge, Epic Swords of Wonder, Merry Mint Axe, a very cool pickaxe as well. Oracle Axe, Reckoning, Dark Splitter, Anarchy Axe, Axe Caliber, which is a season two pickaxe, if you guys didn't know. Boulder Breakers, Bunker Basher, Burning Blades, Dive Knives, Scale Force, Gilded Skepter, Glow Stick, Golden King, Hack Smash, Josie, Lollipopper, Peppermint Pick, the Pulse Axe, which is a season two battle pass pickaxe, Reaper, Shooting Star Staff, Shortbread Slicers, Smash a Lantern, Smash Up, Solid Scratch, Star Wand, which is a very sweaty pickaxe if you guys didn't know, Dotted Axe, TNT, Vision, which is a sweaty pickaxe as well, Banana Axe, Bold Bar, Calper, Driver, Grim Axes, Icebreaker, Jack Spammer, Noggin, Sharky Slappers, Throwback Axe, Tree Splitter, you shouldn't have, which is a very OG pickaxe, actually. I really never see this pickaxe in people's lockers. This is actually a pretty sick pickaxe. And the default pickaxe. Okay, so as you guys can tell, just from looking at the pickaxes, this guy is actually an OG player. So we haven't actually looked at the skins yet, but imagine if he actually had more OG skins. Like if he had the Renegade, the Aerial Assault Trooper, or like the Gold Trooper. Dude, that would literally be insane. That would make my day, dude. Okay, I know you guys have all been waiting for it. We are now gonna look at the skins. Okay, he actually has a pretty nice amount of skins. Starting from the top, he has the Deadpool skin, the Black Knight, which we already saw, the Calamity... The carbide, does he have all the styles to carbide? Oh, he actually didn't unlock all the styles to carbide. Honestly, it's fine, but the gear specialist, he didn't even upgrade the gear specialist. That's a little odd, I'm not gonna lie. Literally, on all the accounts I review, I always see the fully upgraded gear specialist, but I've never seen someone not upgrade it. That's honestly pretty unique, though, to be honest with you. The Heim skin, which is a legendary skin. It's a very sweaty skin, in my opinion. The Leviathan, the Midas. Oh, he is gold Midas, dude. Let's go. The Omen, Power Cord, Raptor, Tempest skin. Valor, Wukong, Dark Red Knight, Dark Wild Card, the Lachlan skin, which is a very sick skin. I was honestly so happy for Lachlan when he got this skin because Lachlan's one of my favorite Fortnite YouTubers. Psylocke, the Shadow Series set, which is pretty cool. Agent Peely. Oh, is the Astro Assassin? Oh my gosh, dude. Dude, I've literally only seen this skin on like two accounts. Oh my gosh, dude. I'm actually so hyped. This is actually so rare, guys. Oh my gosh. The Battle Hawk, Brutus, Chaos Agent, Chaos Double Agent. Cloak Shadow, Dante, DJ Yonder, Double Agent Hush, Double Agent Wildcard. Dude, there's no way he has this skin, bro. Oh my gosh, guys. I literally got this account for $1, dude. This is actually insane. Oh my gosh, guys. I'm actually... Dude, dude, there's no way he actually has the OG Gold Trooper, bro. Oh my gosh, dude. This is actually insane, guys. Oh, and he's the Honor Guard as well, dude. This is so rare as well. Oh my gosh, guys. OG Gold Trooper and the Honor Guard skin, guys. These are literally so rare, dude. No way. This is actually nuts, boys. Oh, and he has the iconic skin, dude. Oh my gosh. There's literally three extremely rare skins right next to each other, guys. Oh my gosh. Imagine if he has the Renegade Raider, too. Oh my gosh, guys. The Love Thorn, the Evergreen, the Meow Skulls, Merry Marauder. Dude, I can't believe he has all those OGs, bro. Those are literally so rare. Gosh, and he has five Mogul Master skins, dude. Why would you need five Mogul Masters, bro? That's a little excessive, dude. The Plague. I actually never see this skin. It's a very rare skin in my opinion. The Rapscallion, the Shadow Ops. Oh, and he has the Purple Skull Trooper, bro. Oh my gosh, guys. This account is actually stacked. For $1, guys, I literally got the most OG account ever, dude. The Sky Sparkle Specialist, which is a Season 2 skin. We were expecting this skin because he did have the Black Knight skin. Star Flare, Draw Op, Technique, Tiantina, Venturion, Whiteout, Zoe, Dark Jonesy, Blue Squire, which is a Season 2 skin as well. Blue Team Leader, Clinical Crosser, Diecast, Dynamo, Fastball is a very cool skin as well. The Focus. This is probably my top five favorite meme skins of all time. But of course, the Slurp skin and the Banana skin are better than this, but it's still an awesome skin. This is actually a very sweaty skin. The Jelly, Complex, Mave, Mesmer, the Moxie, Pit Stop. Always oh, a Royal Knight skin, which is a Season 2 skin as well. The Rue, Sea Wolf. I actually made this skin back in Chapter 2, Season 5, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it's an awesome skin, to be honest with you. The Waypoint, Wooly Warrior, a Brute Gunner, Bullseye, Clash. 
Envy, the taco skin. This is a very funny meme skin as well. The nightlight, the PJ patroller, and the Yuletide Ranger. Guys, I literally can't believe all the OG skins we got from this Fortnite account. If you want to give away this Fortnite account, like and subscribe right now. So in today's video, we're going to be buying more Fortnite accounts off of eBay. You guys have been absolutely loving this series. So yeah, I'm going to keep buying Fortnite accounts for you guys. Disclaimer, please don't actually buy Fortnite accounts on eBay. Guys, it is extremely sketchy. I've literally gotten scammed so many times. So yeah, I really wouldn't recommend buying Fortnite accounts on eBay. Okay, guys, so we're now on eBay. So we're just going to search up Fortnite account stacked skins. Okay, guys, so I've been scrolling on eBay for about 30 minutes now, and I actually found some pretty cool Fortnite accounts to buy. Okay, so the first account I found is an OG Season 1 Fortnite account. It has Black Knight, Mako Glider, Stealth, Reflex skin, and it's $500. So for $500, I could get the Black Knight and a ton of more skins. It looks like this guy has like over 100 skins. So yeah, this is actually a pretty good account to buy. But obviously, we're gonna keep looking because there's probably better deals out there. Oh, wow, I actually found a pretty good account. So this is a Wildcat skin account. It's only $150, which is pretty good for the skin it has on it. Guys, the Wildcat is literally like an $100 skin. So this is actually a really good deal. I also found this one right here. It says Fortnite account, 218 skins with season two battle pass skins and 1600 in earnings and save the world stuff. So he bought save the world. He has like 200 skins and he has a ton of earnings. I mean, I don't know why earnings would even matter, but I mean, for $200, like this is actually a pretty good deal. I probably am not going to buy this one just because it probably doesn't have any OG skins on it so there's just no point for me to buy it you know what i mean but yeah we're just gonna keep looking guys okay guys so i actually found another black knight account it says fortnite account og skin has 1200 v bucks on it and more say the world stuff so guys this is honestly a pretty good deal i'm probably gonna buy this one but i still want to look just in case there's something better okay guys you know what i thought that that fortnite account we just found was good but i think i found literally the best fortnite account ever guys this one says insane fortnite account aerial assault trooper renegade raider and the galaxy skin guys you don't know how much i want the aerial assault trooper i've literally never had it out of all the accounts i've bought i've literally never gotten the aerial assault trooper guys honestly i want to get this so bad so in the picture it doesn't even show the aerial assault trooper it only shows the galaxy skin honestly i think it's worth the risk though like guys i think i'm actually gonna buy this one this is actually insane but if i get scammed i'm gonna be pretty pissed i'm not gonna lie but i really think it's worth it guys all right you know i'm literally buying this right now i'm just gonna catch you when i'm in the locker okay guys so we're now logged into the account i don't know if this is a joke or anything but he literally has like nothing equipped right now the only thing he has equipped is literally the commando skin guys i'm literally expecting the renegade raider the aerial soul trooper and the galaxy skin but yeah we're just gonna get right into this locker tour and we're gonna start with the pickaxes okay so he has a decent amount of pickaxes so obviously the guy didn't say he had any rare pickaxes so i'm not gonna be pissed if he doesn't have anything good he has the aquaman's trident the pry axe gilded morphid blades oh he has all the marvel series pickaxes which is pretty cool a lot of the fortnite accounts i actually review have all the marvel series pickaxes so it's really cool seeing all of them the shadow slicer sludge hammer the beast fang crystal axe of masters dragon claw the eon blades epic source of wonder the flawless this is a very clean pickaxe in my opinion the fusion scythe the reckoning swag smasher fret basher marshy smasher i really like this pickaxe as well honestly this is the best sounding pickaxe in the game six carat cutter abominable axe Angler axes, bank shots, boulder breakers, breathless blades, chainsaw, chop chop, pro bar. I really like this pickaxe as well. This is like one of the most sweaty pickaxes in the game. Dive knives, dread, drummies, frosty globes, scale force, golden king, gilded glow. I like this pickaxe as well. It's really clean. Hack and smash, highlight strikers, Josie, lock pick, medax, null claws. I really like the null claws as well. I think they're pretty cool. A peppermint pick. The pop axe, brilliant blades, shooting star staff, short bread slicers. This is a very cool pickaxe. It's a really good pickaxe to wear during the Christmas time. Smash a lantern, smash up, snake bite, snowy. It's a really cool pickaxe to wear in Christmas time as well. The solid scratch, very clean pickaxe. Specialist pickaxe, star wand, tide axes. TNT, Venom Blade, Victor's Frail, very cool pickaxe as well, boys. Vision Strikers, Wrenchers, Banana Axe, Basic Basher, Chew Toy, Driver. This is one of my main pickaxes. I honestly love this pickaxe. Mean Streak, Warhammer, Oath and Sorrow, Old Woody, 
Rose Glow, Tech Axe, a very cool pickaxe as well. Throwback Axe, Toe Pick, and the default pickaxe. Okay, guys, so just looking at those pickaxes, I'm honestly kind of scared. Like, he literally had no good pickaxes. He didn't even have any Season 2 or 3 pickaxes. Honestly, I just hope we get really lucky and he just has all the OG skins. I know you guys have all been waiting for it. We are now going to look at the skins. I am really hoping that we didn't get scammed, guys, but I'm honestly a little scared right now. Okay, he has a pretty decent amount of skins. That's a pretty good sign. Starting from the top, we got the whole Frozen series pack. So he's a Frozen Love Ranger, Frozen Raven, and the Frozen Red Knight, of course. The Deadpool skin, which is a Marvel series skin. Mandalorian. The Blackheart. Does he have all the styles to Blackheart? He does have every single style to Blackheart. The Calamity, which is a very nice skin as well. I hope he has all the styles to Calamity. He has every single style to Calamity as well. Let's go. The Carbide skin. Oh, so he doesn't have all the styles to Carbide. I mean, it's obviously fine, but this is a season four skin. That's honestly really good. The Eternal Knight. Fade. Fusion. I really like this skin as well. It's super dope. Gear Specialist. Oh, he actually cut customize this gear specialist pretty well i really like seeing all the people who have this skin because as you guys know when this skin was out it was actually a customizable skin and you could only customize it one time so it's really cool seeing all the different customizations of this skin so yeah it's pretty cool honestly the hybrid is he have all the styles of hybrid he has every single style of hybrid as well the chimera the lux the menace the midas does he have gold midas oh wow he has gold midas let's go the Predator, Raz, Rose Team Leader, the Ruin Skin, War Paint. This is a Season 3 skin. The Aquaman, which is a DC Series pickaxe. The Lara Croft. All the Marvel Series skins. He had all the Marvel Series pickaxes as well, which is pretty cool. Ruby Shadows, 8-Ball versus Scratch. He had the Agent Jones. Agent Peely. Does he have all the styles of Agent Peely? He has every single style of Agent Peely as well. The Bandolier. Honestly, I never really see this skin. This is, a, this is honestly kind of a rare skin, to be honest with you. Like, I literally never see that skin. Battlehawk. The Brutus. He has Gold Brutus as well. Cameo versus Chick. Chaos Double Agent. A very sweaty skin. The Clock skin. DJ Yonder. The Doggo skin. I actually love the Doggo skin. It's one of the best meme skins in the game. I'm not even gonna lie. Oh, he is. Both of the double agent sets, which is pretty cool. The double agent hush and the wild card. The, the ember, which is a season eight skin. The fable, giddy up, jewels, kit, condor, lexa. The evergreen skin, this is such a meme skin as well. The man cake is also a meme skin. Master key, mave, meowskulls. Does he have gold meowskulls? He has gold meowskulls. Let's go. Ocean, Peely, Reese, Scuba Jonesy, Sidewinder, Siona, Sky, Sunny, Tirana, Tiantina. The Slurp skin, I actually love this skin. Honestly, I'm gonna put this in the number one spot with the best meme skin. This is definitely the best meme skin. Oh, let's go. He has a season two skin. Guys, he has the Blue Squire skin, which is extremely rare. Okay, this is a really good sign that he'll have the Renegade Raider, guys. The Chance, Diamond Diva, Iris, Journey versus Hazard, Penny, the Soccer skin. I actually love the soccer skin. It's extremely sweaty, boys. Remedy versus Toxin, Swift, Tart Tycoon, Wooly Warrior, Yellow Jacket, Brute Gunner. Come wait, guys, what? Guys, we're literally on the uncommon skins, and there was no OG skins. Hold on, I gotta double check. Hold on, guys. I think I might have missed an OG skin or something. Wait, what? It, bro, what is this account? Oh my gosh, bro. This account is trash, bro. He literally said he had the Renegade Raider, bro. I just lost $300. Are you kidding me? So in today's video, we are going to be buying more Fortnite accounts off of eBay. Like I say in almost all my other videos, please don't actually buy Fortnite accounts on eBay. Guys, I literally got scammed so many times from buying Fortnite accounts on eBay. So yeah, I just really wouldn't recommend it. This video is only for entertainment purposes only. Before I start the video, please be sure to subscribe with all all noties on but yeah just click the subscribe button guys it is literally free okay guys so we are now on ebay okay so we're just gonna search up fortnite account og skins okay guys so i've been scrolling on ebay for a little bit now and i actually found some pretty cool fortnite accounts to buy so i found this one right here it says renegade raider account 300 plus skins og stacked and super rare bro this is literally a scam bro like like you're not selling the renegade raider for ten dollars dude guys this is obviously a scam i'm definitely not gonna buy this one i might buy this for another video but honestly like dude like this is definitely a scam like no one's gonna buy your account for ten dollars there's also one right under it it says fortnite og account og skins season 2 135 skins on pc so it shows the og skull trooper and it's only twenty dollars this doesn't look as sketchy as the other one because the og skull trooper is a lot cheaper than the renegade raider so i'm gonna keep my eye out on this one but yeah this is actually a pretty good deal i'm not gonna lie okay guys i actually found a really crazy fortnite account so this one says fortnite og i don't know why the title 
title of this eBay listing is so bad, but it's a hundred dollars and it shows the aerial assault trooper. Oh my gosh, guys. I actually want to buy this so bad. This is crazy. Okay, guys. So I actually found something a little bit different. So this is Fortnite mystery box account. Chance of getting the renegade raider and OG skins. So I'm pretty sure that a mystery box account is just a random account he has. I bet he probably has like hundreds of accounts and he just sells random ones. Honestly, guys, I mean, there's a chance I could get an OG skin. I might just buy this Fortnite mystery box account because I've never actually bought one of these before. You know, I might just give this one a shot. I mean, why not? You know what, guys? I'm just gonna buy this. I mean, it's kind of expensive, but like, what if I get the Renegade Raider? That would be pretty cool. All right, I'm gonna buy this one, boys. I'll catch you when I'm in the locker. Okay, boys, so we are now in the Fortnite locker. As you guys can see, he has the aura equipped and he has a ton of emotes and a ton of pickaxes equipped as well. Honestly, guys, this account might be pretty good. Of course, to start off the locker review, we're gonna look at the pickaxes. Okay, he has actually a decent amount of pickaxes. So he has the DC series pickaxe, the dragon's claw, the dual edge, the eon blades, epic swords of wonder, the flawless, the harmonic axes, the ice scepter, which is a season seven pickaxe, the mech axe, power claws, the scorcher, scratch mark, swag smasher, the vox, bunker basher, cosmic cleavers, dive knives. He's a few other pickaxes, guys. Honestly, these aren't two rare pickaxes, but honestly, like it's a pretty good account. I'm not gonna lie. These pickaxes aren't that bad. Okay, guys, so he actually has a decent amount of pickaxes. None of them were super rare, so I kind of just like went through them pretty fast. So we're gonna look at the skins now, guys. I know you guys have all been waiting for it. Okay, let's hope he has something OG. Let's see. Um, I'm not seeing anything OG. G, but let's just look. Oh, he has the Deadpool skin. Oh, he's a black heart. Does he have all the styles of black heart? Let's go. He has every single style of black heart. The catalyst, eternal night, the fade, gear specialist. Oh, he's a pretty cool version of gear specialist. The hybrid, the lux. I love the lux skin as well. The lynx. Does he have all the styles to lynx? Yes, sir. He has every single style of lynx as well. The Midas. Does he have gold Midas? He has gold Midas. Let's go. The rocks, ruin, sentinel, singularity. Oh, wow. It's a pretty cool skin as well. The ice king. He's a lot of battle pass skins, which is pretty cool. Cool. Zenith, Aquaman, Thor, which is a Marvel series skin. Agent Peely, Brutus, Bunker Jonesy, Cobalt, Demi, Ember. Oh my gosh, bro. He's the iconic skin. No way, dude. Dude, the iconic skin is so rare. Let's go, dude. Okay, this account is definitely worth it. I mean, $100 and I got the iconic skin. Bro, this skin is literally so rare. I'm so excited, dude. Let's go. Jewels, Hit, Master Key, bro. Let's go. I can't believe he had that, dude. That's such a good skin. The onesie, Peely, the powder skin. Scuba Jonesy, Sergeant Winter, Sidewinder, Fiona, Sky, Stratus, Summer Drift, Summit Striker, Tilted Technique, Trog, Vega, Versa, Wild, X Lord, Laguna, and the Aura skin. You know what, guys? Honestly, I think this account was worth it. So for $100, I got the iconic skin and a ton of other super cool skins. So yeah, for $100, this was definitely worth it, guys. So obviously, I'm not going to end off the video right there. I think we're going to try to buy one more Fortnite account. Okay, guys, so we're now back on eBay. So I actually found another mystery box Fortnite account. I didn't actually know that they had so many of these on eBay, but all I did was I searched up Fortnite mystery box accounts and a ton of them showed up. So I found this one right here. It says random Fortnite account, 30 to 300 skins, full access and a potential OG skin. Guys, this is honestly worth it. I think I'm going to buy another one for you guys. Literally just smash the like button, guys. I'm literally buying these Fortnite accounts for you guys. I really hope I don't get scammed. So yeah, I'm just going to buy this account right now. Let's get into it. Okay, guys. So I'm now in the Fortnite account. So he already has some stuff equipped. He literally has the hot dog skin equipped, the back bling to it, and the pickaxe. So I'm um, guessing this guy really likes the hot dog skin. It's pretty funny, to be honest with you. But yeah, we're just gonna get right into this locker. Okay, he actually has a pretty nice amount of pickaxes. Remember, guys, I got this account for about $30, so this actually might be a pretty good deal. So starting off at the top, we got the DC series pickaxes, the gaming legend pickaxes. Oh, the icon series pickaxe. I've actually never seen this before. This is a really cool pickaxe. The Marvel series, the sledgehammer, beast fan. Chomp Jr., Crystal Axe of Masters, the Dragon Claw, Epic Swords of Wonder. Oh, the Eva Pickaxe, which is a Season 3 pickaxe. Let's go, dude. The Flawless, the Fusion Scythe, Ice Scepter, Onslaught, Permafrost, Reckoning, the Scorcher, Scratch Mark, Spire Flame, Trusty Number 2, the Vox, the Gaming Legend Pickaxe, the Crowbar. This is a really sweaty pickaxe. I actually really like this pickaxe as well. The Dive Knives, the Drummies, Frosty Globes, Gale Force, Gilded Scepter, a very cool pickaxe as well. Golden 
King, Gilded Glow, Hack Smash, Highland Strikers, Josie, the Hot Dog Pickaxe. He already had this equipped. The Lock Pick, the Lollipopper, Lug Axe, Med Axe, the No Calls, the Peppermint Pick. I really like this pickaxe as well. It's a super good pickaxe. Ripe Rippers, Sawtooth, Shooting Star Staff, Shortbread Slicers, Smash a Lantern, Specialist Pickaxe, Well Striker, Tenderizer, Banana Axe, Basic Basher, Fork Knife, Hydraulic Wrencher, Laser Pick, and the Mean Streak. Oh, he also has a ton more. I kind of miss these, but he has a ton more uncommon pickaxes. Okay, guys, just looking at all the pickaxes he has, this account actually is kind of worth it. But I'm just hoping that he'll have some OG skins in his locker. I know you guys have all been waiting for it. We are now going to look at the skin. Oh, wow. He actually has a ton of skins. Oh, my gosh, dude. Wow. He has a lot of skins, dude. Okay, we're going to start from the top. We got the Marvel series, the Star Wars skin, the Blackheart, Calamity, Carbide, which is a season four skin. This is honestly a good sign that he'll have OG skins because this is a pretty rare skin. Catalyst, Dark Voyager, which is a season three skin. Let's go, dude. The Dyer, Drift, Enforcer, Fusion, Gear Specialist. He's a pretty cool version of Gear Specialist. The Hybrid, a Love Ranger, Luck, Lynx, Menace. Does he have Gold Might? Yes, sir. He has Gold Midas. Let's go. Omega, does he have the fully upgraded Omega? He does. Let's go, dude. Power Cord, Ragnarok, Rose Team Leader, Rock, Sentinel, Fire Assassin, Tempest, Ice King. Oh, he has a John Wick skin, which is a Season 3 Tier 100 skin. Guys, this account is honestly so worth it. I mean, by looking at all the skins we got, I mean, we already are set. We we got a lot of skins already. The Visitor. Dude, he has so many skins, bro. Oh my gosh. We're gonna have to skip through some of these, dude. He has so many skins, bro. Oh, he has both of the Mission Specialists and the Moonwalker, which are Season 3 skins. Night Night, Onesie, Overtaker, Peely, Powder, Redline, Reese. Oh, he's the Rogue Agent, the Rook, Russell Lord, very rare skin, Tidewinder, Sky. Dude, he has a lot of skins, bro. Oh my gosh, dude. This account is actually stacked, bro. The Trailblazer, Trog, Vega, Wingman, Yonder, which is a pretty cool skin. Zoe, the Slurp skin, Beach Bomber, Bronto, the Dynamo, Fishstick, Grimbles, Journey vs. Hazard, the Reflex. I'm pretty sure this is actually a rare skin. I'm pretty sure you had to buy a graphics card to get this skin. This is actually so sick. Stealth Reflex, Sunbird, Jolly Jammer, Jonesy, Light Show, Recon Ranger, Red Jade, Toy Trooper, and the Verge skin. So in today's video, we're going to be searching for Fortnite accounts on eBay. Like I say in almost all my other videos, please do not actually buy Fortnite accounts. As you guys know, it is extremely sketchy and you might get scammed. So yeah, guys, don't even risk it and please don't actually buy Fortnite accounts. I'm only doing this video for entertainment purposes only. Okay, guys, so we are now actually on eBay. So we're just going to search up Fortnite accounts OG skin. Okay, guys, so I've actually been scrolling on eBay for a little while now, and I actually found some pretty cool accounts to buy. As you guys can see right here, it says Fortnite account, 14 skins, rare items only on PC. So I can see some rare skins. He obviously doesn't have a lot of skins. He actually has some pretty old Battle Pass skins. This honestly isn't a bad deal, to be honest with you. For $19, it's not a bad deal, to be honest with you. If you guys could see this one right here, it says Fortnite account, 13 rare skins only on PC. It's $95, but as you guys can see right here, it shows the Galaxy skin and i see some other skins in here he only has 13 skins as it says right here but honestly a hundred dollars for the galaxy skin is pretty good i also found this one right here it says fortnite renegade raider account 150 skins rare items wow this is actually a really good deal guys i mean a thousand dollars is obviously a ton of money but i mean the renegade raider is kind of worth that kind of money i don't know if you guys know how rare the renegade raider is like that skin is literally so rare so i think it's worth it honestly i might get this one but i'm gonna keep looking oh guys look at this one it says a hundred 180 skins OG Fortnite account. It has the Galaxy skin. I also see the Elite Agent, I'm pretty sure. And I also see the Ginger Gunner as well. It's kind of hard to see because it's like really far, but this one's $190. It says Season 1 OG skins and Tournament Spray Fortnite account PS4 and PC. Guys, it has the OG Gold Trooper. I see the Sparkle Specialist as well. This is actually a pretty good deal. I'm not even gonna lie to you. I'm definitely gonna keep my eye on this one because this is a really good deal and I really want the Purple Skull Trooper. Okay, guys. I literally think I found the best account. Guys, this one literally says Renegade Raider account, rare pickaxes and rare skins. Guys, you won't believe it. It literally says $5. Oh my gosh, bro. $5 for a Renegade Raider account? Bro, there's no way. I'm literally gonna buy this one. As you guys can see in the 
picture though it doesn't show the renegade rare that's a little suspicious to me it only shows the black knight that's honestly a little weird but dude i mean five dollars like i really can't pass up on this like guys i'm literally gonna buy this account right now i've been thinking a lot about this guys i'm literally gonna buy this account right now so i will catch you when i'm logged into the account okay guys so we're now logged into the account as you guys can see i already see the royal knight skin as you guys know this is a season two skin it was part of the season two battle pass so that's already a really good sign that he might actually have the renegade raider like he said and there's also a ton of emotes over here as well so yeah we're just gonna get right into this locker tour and we're gonna start with the pickaxes oh my gosh guys he's a ton of pickaxes let's go dude okay we're gonna start from the top we got the dark series pickaxe we got all the dc series pickaxes as well we got the gaming legends pickaxe as well everyone has that marvel series we know like all these accounts already have these um we have the sludge hammer the acdc which is a season two pickaxe this is a season two pickaxe if you guys don't know it's super rare be saying cosmic llama corn crystal axe of masters dragon's claw eon blades eva this is a season three pickaxe as well guys the flawless fusion scythe i really like this pickaxe i don't know it's just a really good pickaxe in my opinion i've always really liked this one. Oh, this one's actually so sick as well i never really see people have this one this one's so sick the ice scepter oh he has a merry mintax that's a super rare pickaxe i've only seen this like three times in a locker before guys this is a super rare pickaxe if you don't know the onslaught permafrost antic pulse power claws reckoning rift edge this is a season five pickaxe that goes with the drift skin scorcher scratch mark sorrow's reach fire flame i really like this one as well swag smasher i'm not a big fan of this one it's just it's just way too big of a pickaxe in my opinion trusty number two this goes with the reaper skin in season three i'm pretty sure frozen axe six carat cutter angler axes axe caliber it's a really cool pickaxe as well it's a season two pickaxe balloon axe bank shots that's a cool this and the reaper used to compete like they both were super rare i always really liked the reaper better but this was honestly really rare back then the boulder breakers breathless blades bunker basher sentry and edge chainsaw cosmic cleavers crowbar dive knives i really like the dive knives i always say it in like every single video the dread drummies Empire Axe, Fang Saws, Frosty Globes, Gale Force, Gold Crow, Gilded Glow, Highland Strikers, Josie. I really like this pickaxe as well, guys. Honestly, like, I think every single locker I've reviewed had this pickaxe. It's honestly so common. Lockpick, Lollipopper, Low and Slow, Lug Axe, Mayhem Scythe, No Claws, Peppermint Pick, Pulse Axe. This is a Season 2 pickaxe as well. I feel like a lot of people forget about how rare this pickaxe actually is. Because, guys, this is a, literally a Season 2 exclusive pickaxe. Reaper, this is a Skull Trooper pickaxe. Sawtooth, Shadow Blades, Shooting Star Staff, Shortbread Slicers, Jellyfish. I've never seen this pickaxe in my whole life. It's a really cool pickaxe, in my opinion. Pretty unique. Smash Lantern, Smash Up, Snake Bite, Snowy, Sparkle Scythe, Star one street blade victor's frail vision very sweaty pickaxe vision strikers wrenchers basic basher driver i really like the driver pickaxe as well hydraulic wrencher icebreaker mean streak both in sorrow all woody rose glow tech axe throwback axe toe pick and the default pickaxe okay guys so we just went through all those pickaxes and he already has a super rare pickaxe he has the Merry Mint Axe, and that axe is extremely rare. Guys, I'm honestly really hoping he'll have the Renegade Raider. He already has a ton of OG stuff, so there's no way he won't have it. I know you guys have all been waiting for it. We are now gonna look at the skins. Oh my gosh, guys. He actually has a pretty nice amount of skins. We're gonna start from the top, guys. We got the Star Wars skin, the Aim, Alley, Backlash. I really like this skin. It's so customizable. I actually love... This is probably one of my favorite skins in the whole game. Oh, he has the Black Knight. Let's go, dude. Okay, I'm happy with that, guys. Black Knight he's a season two tier 100 skin extremely rare guys black heart does he have all the styles he does have all the styles the black heart calamity carbide does he have all the styles the carbide as well he does let's go catalyst dark voyager this is a season three skin dire drift he has a lot of battle pass skins actually the fade he has all the styles to fusion as well i love the fusion skin hybrid we got the lux skin does he have all the styles to lux he does have all the styles to lux as well oh he has the link skin menace Omega, Predator, Ragnarok. I really like the Ragnarok skin as well. It's kind of a big skin to wear in game, but it's honestly a really nice skin. Raz, Rose Team Leader, Ruin, Fire Assassin, the Ice King, Prisoner, Reaper skin. I really like the Reaper skin as well. It's a season three tier 100 battle pass skin. It's honestly really rare. 
The Visitor, Valor, Warpaint, Wukong, Zenith, Dark Red Knight, Dark Wildcard, The Green Arrow, Rebirth Raven. He has the Icon series skin. He has all the Marvel series skins as well. A lot of the accounts I review actually have a lot of Marvel skins. So it's really cool seeing all the accounts with it. He has the Ruby Shadow, 8-Ball vs. Scratch, Agent Jones. He has both of the Alpine Aces. He has a Canadian version and he has the USA version as well. The Battle Hawk, Bright Gunner, Demios. Oh, this is actually a really cool skin as well, guys. I don't really see a lot of people with this skin on their account. DJ Yonder, Dusk, Elite Agent, which is a Season 3 skin. Ember, Fable, Funk Ops, Gold Trooper. Does he have the... Oh, he doesn't have the pink version of Gold Trooper, but it's all good. Giddy Up. Ginger Gunner. I actually love this skin. I think this is in my top five favorite skins of all time. Huntress, Jewels, Kit, Condor, Lexa. I don't really like this skin too much. The Evergreen skin. Mancake. This is such a meme skin. Mari Gold. This is a Midas, but a girl version. Master Key, Maeve, Mission Specialist, Mogul Master, Canadian version. He is the Moonwalker, which is a season three skin. This guy's an OG player, if you guys can't tell. I'm really hoping he'll have the Renegade Raider, like he said. Powder, Rapid. Rabbit Raider, Redline, Reese. Wow. I've never seen this version of Reese. This is actually so sick. The Rogue Agent, Rook, Rust Lord, Scuba Jonesy, Sergeant Winter, Sidewinder, Fiona, Sledgehammer, No Mando, Sparkle Specialist, which is a Season 2 skin. It was up there in the tiers with the Black and Ice skin back in Season 2. Sparkle Supreme, Spash Specialist, Technique, The Ace. Tilted Technique, Wingman, X-Lord, Yonder, Zoe, Dark Jonesy, the Slurp skin, Oh, the soccer skin. He's the boy version. I barely see the boy version of the soccer skin. Arctic Assassin, the Blue Squire, another season two skin. Ruby, Centrion, Cryptic, Diamond Diva, Dream, Finesse Finisher, the Frost Squad, Hush, Journey vs. Hazard, Recon Specialist. We should be seeing the Renegade Raider soon. Royal Knight, season two skin. Ruby, Sandstorm. Where, where is the Renegade Raider, guys? I don't what? Um, well, we're on the green skins now, guys. I'm pretty sure he doesn't have Renegade Raider. I'm gonna do another double check, though. Oh my gosh, guys. Uh, this guy doesn't have Renegade Raider, dude. Oh my gosh. Listen, guys, you know, I bought this account for $5. The guy said he had Renegade Raider, but he obviously doesn't have it. I mean, I'm still happy with what we got. We got all the Season 2 and 3 skins. Just sadly, we didn't get the Renegade Raider like he said we were gonna get it. So yeah, we did get scammed, but I'm not too angry about it so in today's video we're gonna be buying a fortnite account off the dark web yes guys you heard me right the dark web i am really hoping i don't get scammed today before i start the video i recommend no one to buy fortnite accounts guys it is extremely sketchy and you will most likely get scammed guys i've literally gotten scammed so many times so just please don't buy fortnite accounts be sure to subscribe with all noties on literally less than half you guys who actually watch my videos are subscribed so yeah just click the subscribe button guys it is literally free and it helps me out so much okay without further ado i'm gonna get right into the video okay guys so i'm now actually on the website so this is honestly really sketchy to find as you guys know from last video this website is extremely sketchy like i don't even know what to expect dude i'm just hoping we won't get scammed again oh wow so this account says og fortnite account with iconic instant delivery and it's only 64 dollars as you guys can see by the skins in the locker i can see the iconic some more legendary skins and a couple more purple skins but it's kind of funny because it looks like the picture of the locker was taken in like season five because that is not what a fortnite locker looks like now that's honestly kind of sketchy so i'm probably not gonna buy this account yo so there's one right next to it it says wildcat account and it's 130 dollars so as you guys can see it is definitely less sketchy because it shows a locker from chapter two because the other locker was literally from like season five dude okay so it runs at about 130 dollars and the wildcat skin is about a hundred dollars i'm pretty sure so that is actually a really good deal and it looks like he has a ton more skins yo we might actually have to buy that bro yo so i actually found this really cool fortnite account so it says random skins fortnite account stack skins guys honestly i kind of want to take the risk and buy this fortnite account but i really don't want to get scammed so honestly i'm gonna be taking a big risk if i get scammed it really won't be that big of a deal honestly guys i think i'm gonna buy this fortnite account it just looks really stacked like i don't know i kind of just want to risk it for the video so yeah i'm gonna catch you guys when i buy this fortnite account 
Okay, guys, so I'm now in the locker. Yo, he actually has the Omega equip, which is a season four skin. Yo, that's actually so sick, dude. So we know that he might actually be an OG player. He didn't say he had any OG skins, but he did say that this account is gonna be extremely stacked. But yeah, for $10, dude, we already got the Omega skin. So that's honestly really good. So to start off the locker tour, guys, we're gonna look at the pickaxes. Yo, he actually has a pretty nice amount of pickaxes. Honestly, a lot. This is honestly a lot of pickaxes for a $10 account. He has the Dark Series pickaxes, the DC Series. Oh my gosh, he has all the DC Series pickaxes. Oh, and he has the Gaming Legend Series pickaxes as well. The Jaguar Strike, the Old Matey, which are both Icon Series pickaxes. Yo, he actually has every single Marvel Series pickaxe pickaxe bro oh my gosh yo i never really see anyone with every single marvel series pickaxe yo that's actually so rare dude oh my gosh yo just looking at these pickaxes guys this account is actually already stacked the riot control which are both star wars pickaxes the combat knife which is actually a pretty sick pickaxe i never really see anyone rocking this pickaxe the controller which is a season 5 pickaxe cosmic llama corn crystal axe of masters starl's knives dragon's claw dual edge which is a drift pickaxe the Eon Blades, which is a pretty sick pickaxe. The Epic Swords of Wonder. The Fusion Scythe. The Golden. The Hammerhead Morty, which is a Rick and Morty pickaxe. Wait, guys, if he has a Rick and Morty pickaxe, that means that he might actually have the Rick and Morty skin. Guys, why would this guy be selling his account if he literally was playing this season? The Kingmaker. Oh, wow. I've actually never seen this pickaxe. Yo, this pickaxe is actually sick, bro. Oh, the Onslaught. Permafrost. The Reckoning. The Rift Edge. Oh, dude, he has a lot of pickaxes, guys. I'm kind of just gonna go through these um oh he's the cold hearted and the frozen axe and the frozen beak marshy smasher oh he's the mellow mallets dude yo these are actually such sick pickaxes bro the shadow strikers the six carat cutter the angler axes um the breathless blade chainsword chop chop the crooked claw the crowbar which is a very sweaty pickaxe the curse claws dread drummies fang saws frosty globes gale force gilded skepter golden king which are both of the gold pickaxes the gilded glow hack smash highlight strikers jaw blade josie lock pick lollipopper low and slow dude it just keeps going bro this guy actually has so many pickaxes bro what the heck the Rebel Slice, Renegade Rollers, the Skepter, which is a Llama Pickaxe, the Shortbread Slicers, Skellyfish, the Slice and Dice, another sweaty pickaxe. I actually really like this pickaxe. Oh, he also has the Sparkle Slice. Dude, I actually love this pickaxe as well. Oh my gosh. The Tide Axes, TNT, the Victor's Frail. We're getting to the Uncommon Pickaxes now. Old Woody, Rose Glow, Silent Strike, Throwback Axe, Toe Pick, and the Default Pickaxe. We didn't even look at the skins yet, and this account is already sacked, bro. Yo, this is actually crazy, guys. I know you guys have all been waiting for it. We are now gonna look at the skins. Let's just hope he has some OG skins. Bro, what? Oh my gosh, bro. This guy's account is so stacked. You guys see all these skins, bro? What the heck? Okay, starting from the top, we get the Frozen series set. So the Frozen Love Ranger, Frozen Red Knight, and the Frozen Raven. The Mandalorian skin, which is the Star Wars series skin, which is pretty cool. The Aim, the Alley skin, the Black Heart. The Calamity. Does he have all the styles to Calamity? He does. Let's go. The Carbide, which is a Season 4 skin. We were expecting this because he did have the Omega skin. The Catalyst. The Crack Shot, which is a very cool skin. This is honestly one of my favorite Christmas skins. The Dire skin. The Drift, which is another Season 5 Battle Pass skin. The Fade. The Fusion. The Galaxy. The Hybrid. The Joey. Chimera. Lynx. Midas. Oh, he has the gold version of Midas as well. He also has the second skin to Midas, which is called the Midas. Rex. Honestly, a super dope skin. Yo, he has the Omega as well. We saw this in his locker right when we opened it up. The Oro. Yo, I actually never see this skin, bro. It's honestly kind of rare, even though it's a Chapter 2 skin. The Predator, the Ragnarok, the Raz, the Red Knight skin, the Rogue Spider Knight, Rose Team Leader, the Ruin skin, the Shogun. This is honestly such a big skin. Honestly, they designed this skin pretty well, but I just think it's way too big. The Super Sonic, the Ice King, the Prisoner, the Visitor... Yo, this guy actually has so many skins, bro. What the heck? The Valkyrie, the Valor, which is a season four skin. So it looks like this guy has actually been playing recently. I don't know why he's selling his account, but the Zero skin, yo, this skin is actually so dope. The Dark Power Cord, yo, I actually never see this skin either. Bro, he has so many DC series skins. He has like all of them, dude. We're on the Gaming Legends series skins now. So he has the Kratos, the Lara Croft, and the Master Chief, of course. These are honestly such dope skins. The Laser Beam skin, yo, I actually never see anyone with 
get this skin equipped. It's pretty cool to see him have this skin because honestly, I wish more people had it. The Marshmallow, the Lava Series skin, the Captain America skin. We are now in the Marvel Series skins. Yo, bro, this guy actually has every single Marvel Series skin. Honestly, guys, that is really rare for me to see every single Marvel Series skin. That's actually dope, though. Yo, and he also has the Thanos skin. This just released, so I don't know why he sold his account. Like, I just don't get it. The Thor, the Tony Stark, of course, Wolverine, the Imperial. Oh, he has all the Star Wars skins as well, which is pretty dope. Yo, we're literally just getting out of exclusive and legendary skins, bro. That's actually crazy how stacked this account is, dude. The Agent Peely, the Battle Hawk, Cameo vs. Chick, Cloud Striker, Cluck, DJ Yonder. Honestly, I'm not a big fan of this skin. Just because there's just better Battle Pass skins out there, but honestly, it's a pretty funny meme skin. I'm not gonna lie. The Ember skin, which is a pretty cool battle pass skin, to be honest with you. The Eternal Voyager, the Fable, the Giddy Up. This guy actually has a lot of battle pass skins. Oh, this skin's actually so sweaty, bro. The Huntress, the Condor, the Alexa, the Alombro, the Nightshade, the Ocean, Onesie, Orella, Peely skin, the Powder, Red Strike, the Red Line, which is a Season 5 skin, the Reese, the Rick and Morty skin. Bro, there's no way this guy has this skin. That's actually so weird how he's selling his account when he literally was playing this season that just doesn't make sense dude like you literally have the tier 100 skin and you're selling your account yo guys this guy actually has so many skins i'm just gonna have to kind of like go through them dude oh my gosh yo i've actually never seen some of the skins on this account like i swear i've never seen this skin bro i don't know if, like i don't even know dude i don't know how i've never seen this tirana the technique which is a season four skin honestly super nostalgic skin for me so it's a technique tiantina the blue team leader this was a ps4 exclusive skin the carbon commando the Centrion, Diamond Diva, Dizzle, Journey versus Hazard, Lovely, Point Patroller, Progedy, Trilogy, Turk versus Riptide, Wavebreaker, Wooly Warrior, Wrath, Yuki, and the Verge skin. Yo, it's actually funny how this guy literally has one uncommon skin. Yo, but honestly, guys, this account was 100% worth it. I went on eBay and bought the most expensive Fortnite account I could find. Make sure you guys watch till the end to see if I actually got scammed or not. Okay, guys, so we are now on ebay so we're just gonna type in fortnite accounts rare skins so obviously in today's video we're gonna be trying to find the most expensive fortnite accounts to buy and yeah let's just hope that we could actually find some cool accounts okay guys so i just found this listing and it says fortnite account and i kid you not guys this account is thirteen thousand dollars now as you guys can see it is rocking the galaxy skin but i wouldn't think that that's worth thirteen thousand dollars like that is an insane deal obviously in a bad way like that is not worth it thirteen thousand dollars is insane like, that's a whole apartment, bro. Like, no one's gonna buy that. But, you know, it is cool to show you guys this account because, you know, it's such a scam. And if anyone buys this, they're practically crazy. Because, like, who in the right mind would buy this account? Okay, I found a Renegade Raider account for $150. You know, I don't really find Renegade Raider accounts for that cheap all the time. But, yeah, I would say this is a pretty good deal. I'm not gonna lie. You know, Renegade Raiders go for $500 to $1,000, even more sometimes. And, you know, if I could get the Renegade Raider for $150, that is actually insane. But I don't know know if i'm gonna do this you know we'll go back to this account if there's nothing else okay guys so this account says random skin account full access now as you guys can see this account is rocking the iconic skin now he says random skin account so obviously there's gonna be random skins on it but you know for a thousand dollars we could actually get a chance of getting the renegade raider skin you know what guys i feel like i should probably buy this account because you know it is a random account and i feel like it makes it more exciting when it's a random account because you know there is a greater risk of me getting scammed obviously i don't want to get scammed but yeah i feel like it would make a great video if if it's an insane account because you know a thousand dollars is actually insane you know what guys i'm just gonna buy this account i'm just gonna risk it for the video for you guys but yeah make sure you guys drop a like and subscribe because i'm about to spend a thousand dollars on this account you know what, guys i'm gonna buy it right now i'll just catch you guys when i'm in the locker okay guys so i am now in the locker and as you guys can see he's rocking the maximilian skin and i looked up the maximilian skin to see how rare it was and guys it hasn't been out in over two years this skin is actually insanely rare boys like i didn't even know it was that rare i just had to look it up but yeah guys this hasn't been out in so long and i can't believe this actually has it on it but yeah this skin hasn't been out in so long and i can't believe this account actually has this skin if any of you guys have the maximilian skin dm me on instagram and yeah maybe i could review your locker because this skin is actually really rare but yeah i'm honestly so excited to review this locker because obviously he does have this skin so he might actually have more rare and exclusive so yeah let's just get right into this locker tour and start off with the gliders but yeah let's just check out these gliders and see all the gliders he actually has okay he actually 
actually does have a decent amount of gliders so far. Let's go. He does have the snowfall of season seven. Very clean. And he also does have the paper parasol of season three. So this means that he's semi OG. But yeah, let's see if he has anything else rare. Oh, he does have the Celesta from the galaxy pack. Very clean. Very clean. Oh, and the flappy from season five. This actually goes with the PS4 exclusive pack. He also does have three DC series gliders, one frozen series, one gaming, two icon, one lava, and four marble. And obviously three Star Wars series gliders. Oh, and he does have the Frostwing, which is very clean in my opinion. I think this goes very well with the Frozen series skins. The Colaxal Blue, very clean. Comet Crasher, Conquest, okay. But yeah, I'm not really seeing anything else. Honestly, guys, a very valid glider walker. Okay, guys, so we are now going to move on to the pickaxes. And yes, guys, he actually does have a lot of pickaxes. Now, let's just see if he has anything super exclusive or rare. Or even anything cool, you know, and you never know. But yeah, let's just start right from the top. So he has two Dark Series pickaxes, three. DC series pickaxes, three frozen series pickaxes, one gaming legend, two icon, one lava, and he has around a row of marble series pickaxes. He also does have the sledgehammer, and he doesn't actually have all the styles to it. He has three Star Wars series pickaxes, which is very clean. He has the riot control, which is a pickaxe that I don't really see that much. The bite mark, blading wedding moon, the candy axe, which is one of my favorite pickaxes. What if he actually has the merry mint axe? Like, that would be actually insane. Because most accounts with the candy axe usually have the merry mint axe as well. The fusion scythe, harmonic axe, Jinju Bang Mech Axe, and he actually does have the Merry Mint Axe. Let's go. If you guys don't know, the Merry Mint Axe is my favorite pickaxe in the game. Merry Mint Axe is my number one favorite pickaxe. Let's go, man. I love this pickaxe, boys. Let me know down below if you guys like the Merry Mint Axe as well. Because, yes, guys, it is literally my favorite. The Scratch Mark Skull Sickle Stardust Strikers, Swag Smasher, Vox, very clean. Dive Knives, Emerald Smasher, Fang Saws, okay. The Reaper of Season 1, Sawtooth, Skepter, Scarlet Scythe, Ski Boot, Snake Bite. He also does have the studded axe. He has the spectral, the basic basher, hydraulic wrencher, very clean. Throwback axe, utility axe, vendor tech elite, wild accent, and to end it off, he has the default pickaxe. Oh, and he does have the vision as well. My bad, guys. Okay, guys, so we are now going to move on to the emotes. And obviously, after the emotes, we're going to look at the skins. So yeah, he actually does have a lot of emotes as well. But yeah, let's just see if he has any rare and exclusive emotes. Oh, he actually does have the take the L of season three. Let's go. As you guys know, the take the L is one of the most iconic Fortnite dances in the game. Oh, and he does have the scenario emote. So this means that he actually has the iconic skin. Let's go. As you guys know, the iconic is a Samsung exclusive skin. And let's go. He does have the emote to it. But yeah, let's see if he has anything else rare. Let's just check his favorite. Okay, he has the dream feat. I'm pretty sure this isn't that rare. The scenario, obviously. Mood moves. Ooh, heart. Okay. And he also does have the Zanny emote. I don't know if this is rare anymore. I don't really know if it came back in the shop. But yeah, I'm pretty sure this used to be pretty rare. But yeah, I'm not really seeing anything else. Ride the pony, which isn't really rare anymore. More. But yeah, I mean, a pretty valid emote locker. I'm not gonna lie, boys. I know you guys have all been waiting for it. We're now gonna look at the skins. Now, he definitely does have a lot of skins. But yeah, I just can't wait to check out this locker. So let's just start off with the first skin. So he has four Dark Series skins, four DC Series skins. He also does have seven Frozen Series skins. He only has one Gaming Legend Series skin. So he's lacking on the Gaming Legend. And he does have five Icon Series skins. He also does have around two rows of Marvel Series skins, which is honestly pretty average. And a few Shadow Series skins as well. He also does have the Ripley vs. Sludge 3 Star Wars Series skins as well. He also does have the Blackheart, Calamity, Carbide, Catalyst, Drift, the Frostbite, Lynx, Hybrid, very clean. The Vertex, Warpaint, Zenith, 8-Ball vs. Scratch, the Fable, Giddy Up, Huntress, and let's go, boys. There is the Iconic skin of Season 8. Very exclusive and rare. If you guys don't know, the Iconic skin is probably one of the rarest exclusive skins in the game. I'm just talking about exclusive skins, obviously not OG skins, but yeah, I would say this is up there in the rarest exclusive skin. I would put this like right near the galaxy skin, honestly. He also does have the skull trooper. Let's click edit style and see if he actually has the OG variant. And sadly, boys, it looks like he actually doesn't have the OG variant to the skull trooper. But you know, it's honestly fine. He might have other OG skins. You never know, boys. He also does have the blue team leader of season two. This is actually surprisingly rare now. You know, a lot of people probably with PS4s have the blue team leader, but let me tell you guys, this is actually kind of rare now. Oh, and he does have the Demogorgon skin, which is pretty rare as well, too. The Demogorgon skin hasn't been out in a long time. Sea Wolf, I don't think this is rare. I'm not sure though. The Trilogy, Turk vs. Riptide, Wavebreaker, Wooly Warrior, Yellow Jacket. I also missed a Prodigy skin he has as well. We are actually in the Uncommon skins, the Red Nose Ranger, Scout, and to end it off, he has the Yuletide Ranger. So a few of the skins that I missed was the Rust Lord of Season 3, the Mission Specialist of Season 3. Obviously, I didn't miss the Iconic, but I just wanted to show you guys again. The Iconic skin, obviously, the Calamity, fully maxed out as well. And the last skin was the blue striker now if i was gonna rate this
this account that I bought on eBay, I would probably give it an 8 out of 10. Now, we bought this account for an insane price, I know, guys. But, you know, it did feel like it was kind of worth it. I mean, we did get a pretty stacked account with the Iconic skin. And some Season 3, and he does have the Battle Bus banner as well. And he also does have the Merry Mint Axe. You know, I don't think it was that much of a scam. It was, you know, it was really expensive, but I don't think I got scammed. But, yeah, let me know down below if you guys thought I got scammed or not, because I'm honestly curious. In today's video, I went on eBay and bought a secret Fortnite account. This account may or may not have had unreleased skins, so be sure to stick around till the end to see if it actually had unreleased skins. Disclaimer, please do not actually buy Fortnite accounts. Buying Fortnite accounts is extremely sketchy, and you will most likely get scammed. Now, I say this in almost all my other videos, so please do not actually do this. I'm purely doing this for entertainment purposes only. So yes, guys, please do not actually buy Fortnite accounts. Also, if you guys aren't subscribed, I'd appreciate it if you guys can. Clicking that subscribe button takes five seconds, so why not subscribe, boys? And it's also literally free, so why not? Okay, without further ado, guys, let's just get right into this video. Okay, guys, so we are now on eBay. So we're just gonna look up Fortnite accounts, rare, and stack skins. Okay, guys, so I actually have been scrolling for about 20 minutes now, and I actually found some pretty cool Fortnite accounts to buy. So I found this account for $42, and it says my Renegade Raider account, and it's $42, which is actually an insane deal for a Renegade Raider account. Like, I'm not even gonna lie, guys, Renegade Raiders run for thousands of dollars, and this one's running for $42. And that is absolutely insane for a Renegade Raider account. But, like, maybe I should buy this account, but I honestly want to keep looking, and there's obviously more accounts that I found that I think you guys might like. But yeah, I'm just gonna show you guys the next account I found. So there's this account right here. It's $1,000, and it says Fortnite account level 862, and it says to read the description. Now, I just read the description, guys, and in the description, it says that this is an unreleased account, and it actually is level 862. Now, for a thousand dollars, I could actually get an unreleased Fortnite account, which could be absolutely insane. And I've actually never bought an unreleased level account like this, so maybe this is actually a good idea to buy this. But you know, we never know if it's a scam or not. So I'm definitely gonna keep my eye out on this account. But obviously, guys, I want to keep looking because there's probably better things out there. And again, I found better deals. So you know, I'm gonna show you guys the next account I found. There is no way I found this account. So it says OG Fortnite account. 67 skins and 1200 v bucks and fast shipping no way oh so it's actually 60 dollars. and as you guys can see in the picture it shows like a question mark and secret skins in it like guys i don't even know i'm actually so confused like what if this has unreleased skins because it does say it's a secret account but you know what? let's just keep looking because i'm honestly really curious if there's any more accounts like this okay guys so i just clicked on the seller's account and he actually has another secret account for listing so it's a secret account unreleased skins and more there's actually no way we could buy this account for 22 dollars and we could literally buy it right now it's for pc so obviously we could get this account right now like i've never seen such a good deal and obviously we don't know what skins are actually on it but you know it is 22 dollars and if we do get scammed it's not going to be the end of the world so, you know guys i'm gonna buy this right now i'll just catch you guys when i'm in the locker okay guys so i just logged into the fortnite account and as you guys can see he has the aerial assault trooper but i am actually so confused i've literally never been this confused in my whole life so as you guys can see obviously he does have the aerial assault trooper equipped which is obviously the rarest skin in the game but as you guys can see i don't know why it's showing the airhead skin like i'm actually so confused i am genuinely so confused right now because this has actually never happened to me i've never had this problem like it's showing a skin and it's not even the right skin like i don't even know if this is fortnite's fault or something but you know what guys i'm just gonna look at this locker to see if this is actually true or not because as you guys know we did just buy this account on ebay and i don't know if it's a scam or not like i don't even know like this looks so glitched to me i'm actually so confused still but honestly guys let's just hope that it's not a scam because as you guys can see he does have the aerial soul trooper to my knowledge but i don't know guys like what is this airhead do? well like what is this doing here i'm so confused okay guys so to start off this locker tour i want to look at the gliders okay so he actually does have a decent amount of gliders so we obviously are going to look for the mako glider let's actually see if he has it because i'm honestly really curious because as you guys know he does have the aerial assault trooper so i'm hoping he'll actually have the mako glider okay and i'm looking for it, it actually looks like 
like he doesn't have it. It's fine though, honestly. He does have three Icon Series gliders as well, which is pretty cool. And around a row of Marvel Series gliders. Oh, and he does have the Guardian Shield, which is actually such a dope glider in my opinion. Okay, he's a decent amount of umbrellas as well. Not that many, but he does have his fair share of umbrellas. He has around like seven seasons of umbrellas. And he does have the Rick's UFO glider, which is from the last battle pass. Oh, and the OHM, which is actually a very dope glider in my opinion. Okay, guys, so we're now gonna move on to the pickaxes, and he actually does have a decent amount of pickaxes. So we're just gonna start from the top. So it looks like he has one Dark Series pickaxe and around a row of DC Series pickaxes. Oh, and he does have three Frozen Series pickaxes, one Gaming Legend, and two Icon Series pickaxes. So I actually love the dual katanas that go with the ninja set. It's actually such a dope pickaxe. And he does have a row of Marvel Series pickaxes, which is actually pretty dope as well. And he does have two Shadow Series pickaxes. So it looks like we're now out of the series pickaxes. So he has the Beef Bone, Corrupted Rift Edges, Cosmic Llama Corn, Demon Slayer Blades. He does have the Eon Blades of Chapter 2 Season 3. Let's go. Hammerhead Morty of Chapter 2 Season 7, of course. Oh, and he does have the Zig Chain Blade, 6 Carat Cutter. We're just gonna keep going through these guys. And I honestly don't really care about a lot of these blue rarity pickaxes that he actually has. Okay, he does have the Reaper of Season 1, which is a pretty dope pickaxe in my opinion. To be honest with you, I don't know if it's that rare, but it is a really dope set of pickaxe. Oh, and he does have the Star Wand, which is actually a really dope pickaxe in my opinion. The 10 Tune Bells as well. Let's go. The Victor's Frail, Vision Strikers, Wrenchers, Banana Axe. So it looks like we are now in the Uncommon Pickaxes. So he's the Icicle, the Warhammer, Oath and Sorrow, Old Woody, Quick Strike, Silent Strike, Cooped Up, the Throwback Axe, Toe Pick, Ultra Scythe. And to end it off, he has the Default Pickaxe. Okay, guys. So we're going to move right into the skins. I can't wait to show you guys these skins because I'm honestly so excited. He does actually have his fair share of skins as well. A pretty mid account. I'm not gonna lie. But as you guys know, he does have the Aerial Assault Trooper. So I just can't wait to see that. And yeah, boys, I can't wait to see the OG Aerial Assault Trooper. Because as you guys know, that is probably the rare skin in the game. But yeah, let's just get right into this locker tour. So he has the Dark Bomber and the Dark Power Cord. Let's go. He has four of the DC Series skins as well. And it looks like he has around a row of Frozen Series skins, which is pretty dope. Oh, and he does have the Kratos, which is a Gaming Legend Series skin. And honestly, a very dope skin. And he does have around four Icon Series skins, which is pretty dope as well. And he does have two Lava Series and around a row of Marvel Series skins. Let me know down below what your guys' favorite Marvel Series skin actually is. So I'm honestly really curious what your guys' favorite Marvel Series skin is. Oh, it looks like he has around four Shadow Series skins and two Star Wars Series skins. In like almost all the accounts I review, I see almost one or two Star Wars Series skins. I feel like a lot of people are lacking Star Wars Series skins, but honestly, it is fine honestly. The Fade, Galaxy, Gear Specialist. I actually really do like how he upgraded the Gear Specialist. I think it's actually such a dope combo that he upgraded it. It's actually really dope, boys. The Cube Queen. Okay, this is actually from the brand new Battle Pass, I think. Let's go. The Torin, Agent Peely, Bone Boss, and the Bone Ravage. Let's go. The Bonehead, Brutus, Burnout, Chaos Double Agent, Charlotte, Cloud Striker, Corrupted. Okay, so it looks like he bought the Corrupted set, which is actually a pretty trash set, my opinion. I don't know, guys. It wasn't that good of a set, in my opinion. Oh, he also bought this set as well, the Double Agent set, which is actually a pretty decent set. And he does have the Fabio, the golden version. Okay. I actually haven't even seen this version yet. Fish School. Okay. The Condor Core Lexa. He actually does have the Rick Sanchez of last season as well. Let's go. Shout out to Rick and Morty. The Skull Squad Leader and the Skull Trooper as well. The Vogue. I don't see this skin that much. It's actually a pretty new and recent skin, so I don't really see it that much. The Arctic Assassin, Baki, Breakpoint, Chig, Codename Elf. I actually really do like this version of the Codename Elf. It goes with the Minty Legend set very well. I actually really do like it a lot. The Dark, Diamond Diva, Dizzle, Echo, Fixer, Frost Squad, Gingerbread Raider, Guff, Hush, the Iris. We're just going to keep going through these. So he's a Maverick, Midfield, Point Patroller, the Powerhouse. I have never seen this skin. Like, guys, I don't even know if this skin came out before. I don't even recognize this skin at all. Let me know down below if you guys have seen this skin before because I've actually never seen this. This is pretty dope though. The Yuki Aura. So we're now in the uncommon skin. So he's the Boxy Bracer, Bullseye, Gage, Shield, Headhunter, Recon Ranger, Red Jade, Swirl Girl. And to end it off, he has the Trinity Trooper. Before I actually end the locker tour, I want to show you guys the emotes he actually has. So he does have a lot of emotes. Look at all the Icon Series emotes he has. But look at this, boys. Look at all the emotes he actually has. So he actually does have the Phone It In emote, which is actually a very dope emote.
Nemo. Yo, guys, so in today's video, we are going to be buying more Fortnite accounts off of eBay. As you guys know, buying Fortnite accounts on eBay is extremely sketchy. So I do not recommend it at all. This video is only for entertainment purposes only. Before I start the video, please be sure to subscribe with all noties on. Literally less than half of you guys who actually watch my videos are subscribed. So yeah, just click that subscribe button, guys. It is literally free. Okay, without further ado, I'm going to get right into the video. Okay, guys, so we're now on eBay. So we're just going to search up Fortnite accounts OG skins. So guys, in this video, we're going to be doing something a little bit different. Instead of finding a random Fortnite account, we are going to find the most expensive Fortnite account on eBay. Like, I'm not even kidding, guys. I'm literally going to spend so much money today. So yes, guys, I'm hoping I won't get scammed because I'm literally going to buy a super expensive Fortnite account today. Oh, wow. I actually found a pretty cool Fortnite account. It says OG Fortnite account, rare skins, pickaxes, and 100 plus emotes. So as you guys can see right there, it shows the OG Gold Trooper skin. So for $1,600, I could get the OG Gold Trooper skin. Honestly, that is way too overpriced. Like just for the OG Gold, that is definitely not worth it. I mean, if he had the Renegade Raider or the Aerial Assault Trooper, it might be worth it. But yeah, that's just not worth it, honestly. Yo, guys, I actually found this super overpriced account. It says OG Fortnite account with over 215 skins. Yo, for $3,900, bro, there's no way you're gonna sell your account with only 200 skins. You don't even say you have OG skins, so there's literally no point of buying this Fortnite account. I just wanted to show you guys how much of a scam this actually was. So I actually found a really crazy Fortnite account. Okay, so I've literally never bought a Fortnite account for $5,000, but I might actually just do it today. So it says Aerial Assault Trooper, Renegade Raider, OG everything, OG skin. Guys, you don't understand how stacked this account could actually be. Like, if you're listing your Fortnite account for $5,000, you gotta have over a thousand skins bro honestly guys i think i'm just gonna buy this account for the video you guys have been showing me so much support on all these videos so honestly guys i'm literally gonna buy it for you guys honestly though i really hope i don't get scammed but yes guys i am gonna buy this account right now i will catch you when i'm in the locker yo there's actually no way bro i literally just opened up this fortnite account and he literally had the galaxy skin equipped guys i've only seen the galaxy skin on two other fortnite accounts i've bought so yes guys it is extremely rare. So to start off the locker tour, we're gonna look at the pickaxes. Let's just hope he has some OG stuff. Yo, he actually has a nice amount of pickaxes. Okay, so we're gonna start from the top. He has the sludge hammer pickaxe, the candy axe, which is a very sweaty pickaxe. Honestly, this is probably the best pickaxe in Fortnite. I don't think there's anything better than the candy axe, honestly. The dragon's claw, the Eva, which is a season 3 pickaxe, a very nice pickaxe. The flawless, fusion scythe, harmonic axes, ice scepter, mech axe, onslaught, Oracle Axe, the Rainbow Smash. I used to rock this back in Season 3, actually. The Reckoning, the Rift Edge. This goes with the Drift Skin. Gorcher, Ratchmark, the Stellar Axe. This is a Galaxy Skin Pickaxe. This is also a very rare pickaxe as well. The Swag Smasher, Vox, Frozen Axe, Marshy Smasher, the Widow's Bite, Abominable Axe, Angler Axes, Balloon Axe, Bank Shots, Folder Breakers, Bunker Basher, Crowbar, Dread, Gale Force, which is a Season 4 pickaxe pickaxe gilded glow highland strikers ice pop which is a pretty cool pickaxe as well lock pick lollipopper lug axe medax peppermint pick which is a chapter 2 pickaxe the revoker ripe rippers scampy scarlet scythe shooting star staff shortbread slicers smash up snake bite swell striker birthday slice icicle simple sledge and the default pickaxe honestly guys those pickaxes weren't that stacked i'm kind of getting scared though because because I did spend $5,000 on this locker. So if I get scammed out of $5,000, I'm actually going to be so angry. Because if he doesn't have OG skins, then we literally got scammed. So I'm really hoping he'll have some OG skins. Okay, I know you guys have all been waiting for it. We are now going to look at the skins. Okay, this is looking a lot better. He actually has a very nice amount of skins. Way more than the pickaxes he had. Okay, starting from the top, we got the Fallen Love Ranger. The Aim. The Black Heart. Does he have all the styles to Black Heart? He has every single style of Black Heart as well. Well, Calamity. Does he have every style of Calamity? He does. Oh, he's fully maxed out Calamity. That's super dope. The Carbide. The Crack Shot. Oh, wow. I've actually never seen this style to Crack Shot. Maybe I never edited the style to this skin, but I've actually never seen this style to Crack Shot. The Dire, which is a Season 6 skin. The Drift, which is a Season 5 skin. The Enforcer. Fusion. Hybrid. Lux. I actually really like this skin as well. I kind of don't talk about it a lot, but I actually really do like this skin. The Lynx. The Oblivion, which is a super sick skin as 
well. Omega, I actually love the Omega too. It's awesome. Like, dude, the colors on this skin are just so sick. The Omen, Ragnarok, the Rocks. I actually didn't really like this skin in the Battle Pass. It's just really overrated in my opinion. Ruin, Sentinel. Come on, where are the OG skins at? We gotta see these OGs, man. Valkyrie, Valor, Season 4 skin. Vendetta, which is also a super overrated skin. I never really liked this skin, honestly. I don't know why, but Zenith, Marshmallow, Black Widow. All the Shadow Series skins. Ape Ball versus Scratch, Battle Hawk, Blitz, Bunker Jonesy, Cameo versus Chick, Chaos Agent. A very sweaty skin as well. I honestly think this skin is super sweaty. Cobalt, Demi, DJ Yonder, Dusk, Ember, Fable, the Galaxy skin, which is extremely rare. He had this equipped in the beginning of the lockers, so we already knew he had this. But yeah, this is honestly the rarest skin we've seen yet, and it's honestly worth a lot of money, so I'm happy he has this at least. The Giddy Up, the Globe Shaker, Huntress, Jack Gordon, which is a pretty cool skin. I really never see this skin. The Kit Bash, Evergreen, Master Key, Merry Marauder. It's very sweaty skin as well. I would say this is probably one of the sweatiest boy skins in the game. Nightshade, onesie. Oh, he has the other style of onesie as well. The Party MVP is a pretty cool skin. The Peely, such a meme skin. Powder, Red Strike, Red Line, which is a Season 5 skin. Rogue Agent, Rook, Sergeant Winter, Sidewinder, Ledgehammer. Another Battle Pass skin I just really didn't like. I don't know. It's just not good, to be honest with you. The Lumber, Slushy Soldier, Squad Leader, Stratus, Summit Striker. I don't see any OG skins, guys. I'm kind of getting worried. The Ace, Trog, Vega, Wild, Wingman, Zoe, which is a season four skin. It's a pretty decent skin. The Slurp skin. Does he have all the styles to the Slurp skin? Oh, he actually didn't unlock all the styles to the Slurp skin. Honestly, it's okay though, but I do really like all the styles to that skin. The Bendy. I actually never see this skin. This is another one of those skins that no one buys in the shop because it's just such a bad skin. Like, you guys can't lie. Like, the Bigfoot, a Bush Ranger, Double Cross, another really sweaty skin that I really like actually. The Dream, Fish Stick, Hopper, Hushkin. I honestly really like this skin as well. It's a super cool skin. The Jelly, the Journey versus Hazard. Guys, I haven't seen a single OG skin. I'm actually getting angry right now, dude. What the heck? Turk versus Riptide, Wave Breaker, Wooly Warrior, Branded, Plastic Patroller, and the Poi Trooper. Bro, like, what is this account, dude? Like, oh my gosh, dude. I literally got scammed. Oh my gosh. I just lost $5,000, dude. I'm literally, dude. Oh my god. The one time I spend a load of money on a Fortnite account, of course I get scammed, dude. Like, oh my gosh, that's actually so annoying. You know what? You know what? To make this account a little bit better, can you at least have the Mako Glider? Okay. You know what, guys? He is the Mako Glider. That's honestly pretty valid. Honestly, really frustrating, guys, but that's what happens when you buy Fortnite accounts on eBay every single day. So honestly, I'm kind of used to it. I went on eBay and bought an insanely stacked Fortnite account. So make sure you guys stick around till the end to see if I actually get scammed. So all we're going to search up is Fortnite. Fortnite account rare skins. So I already found this account right here and it says OG Fortnite account with the Black Knight, Wildcat, Iconic, and the Royal Bomber. Now that's actually a pretty good deal. I mean, for $300, we could get a pretty OG account, but I want to show you guys another account. It's right under and it says OG skins full access. And yes, guys, it is $770. And yes, we are getting the OG Renegade Raider skin. I mean, this is a pretty good deal. I'm not going to lie. Like I would definitely take the Renegade Raider for about $700. Yeah, that's pretty good. But yeah, these both are pretty cool accounts. I just want to see if there's any other rare or stacked accounts. So here's another Renegade Raider account and it's $200. It's pretty cheap, honestly, for a Renegade Raider. I mean, $200 is pretty good for a Renegade Raider. I'm not even gonna lie. Yeah, Renegade Raider usually goes for about $1,000, I would say. And yeah, if I could get it for $200, that is actually such a W. But guys, I found a Renegade Raider account that's even cheaper than the other one. This one's $150 and it says Renegade Raider account. So you know what, guys? I'm gonna buy this Renegade Raider account and yeah, I'll just catch you guys when I'm in the locker. I just hope I don't get scammed. Okay, so he is rocking the iconic skin to start off the locker tour. Let's go, man. The iconic skin is already a great sign that he might actually have the Renegade Raider skin. Oh, and I just realized he has the Battle Bus banner, which is another great sign that he probably has the Renegade Raider because the Battle Bus banner is a season one exclusive banner. Let's go. Okay, so he actually does have a decent amount of gliders as well. But yeah, let's see if he has any rare and exclusive gliders, obviously. He does have the Flappy of season five. This is a PS4 exclusive 
elusive glider. Let's go. He does have around three rows of umbrellas as well. But yeah, I'm gonna look for more gliders. Oh, he does have the cozy coaster of season one. I really do like this glider. It's pretty clean. He does have the Colaxal Blue, which is a glider that I really never see. It's actually super dope though. Not to mention, guys, he does have like three Marvel series. He has three Star Wars, one Lava, two Icon. He also does have three DC and one Frozen. And don't forget the gaming legend, of course. I love the back glider though. It's actually so dope. Okay, he does have a few pickaxes as well. I can't wait to review these because, you know, he might actually have some OG pickaxes. So we're just going to start from the top. So he has two Dark series. He has three DC series pickaxes. He also does have around three Frozen series, one Gaming Legend, two Icon series pickaxes. He has one Lava series pickaxe. And he also does have around four or five Marvel series pickaxes as well, which is pretty valid. He also does have three Star Wars series pickaxes, the Bite Mark. So it looks like we're now out of the series pickaxes. Let's go. The Candy Axe of Season 1, Controller, Cosmic Llama Corn. Let's just keep going through these. Not to mention, guys, the Candy Axe is one of my favorite pickaxes in the game. So it's actually pretty hyped that he has it. Fusion Scythe, Jinju Bang, Mech Axe. Okay, he actually does have the Merry Mint Axe. The Merry Mint Axe is one of my favorite pickaxes in the game. I absolutely love this pickaxe. If you guys have been watching my channel for a while, you guys know that I love this pickaxe. It is absolutely insane. And yeah, it is my favorite pickaxe of all of Fortnite. The Scorcher, Rift Edge, Scratch Mark, Skullsicle, Stardust Strikers, Abominable Axe, the Battle Axe, Bunker Basher, Chaos Scythe, very clean, Chill Axe, the Reaper of Season 1, Brilliant Blades, Renegade Rollers, very clean, the Ski Boot. I remember when the Ski Boot came out, it was actually insane. The Solid Scratch, Sparkle Scythe, Specialist Pickaxe. Okay, he does have the Studded Axe of Season 5 as well, Swell Striker, Venom Blade, Vision of Season 7, the Icebreaker, so we are obviously now in the Uncommon Pickaxes, so he's the Old Woody, the Clobbers, Quick Strike, Rose Glow, very clean, the Tech Axe. Act, the wild accent and to end it off here's the default pickaxe okay he actually does have loads of emotes as well and yes guys here is the iconic skin emote the scenario emote which is absolutely insane i love this emote it's so clean and you know it's so fire obviously and of course it's rare he also does have around like a row and a half of icon series emotes as well which is pretty clean but yeah we're obviously going to be looking for all the rare emotes that he has or even any cool emotes he has Oh, I love the trombone emote. It's actually so funny. The side hustle, very clean. He also does have the take the L of season three, which is actually pretty rare now. Yeah, the take the L is honestly kind of rare now. I'm not gonna lie. He also does have loads of uncommon skins as well. Honestly, I don't feel like going through every single emote on this list, but yeah, you guys can obviously see all of them. And yeah, it's pretty insane. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, he does have one Marvel series emote, the scoot, and I like this emote as well. Let me know down below if you guys like the scoot and emote, or if you have the scoot and emote, let me know down below in the comment section. I'm honestly really curious. Because I see this emote so much in Party Royale. And yeah, the boring boogie down. Yeah, I'm not really seeing anything else that rare. So I think we're going to move into the skin. Okay, so he actually does have a ton of skins. I cannot wait to review this. So he has four Dark Series skins. He also does have four DC. Okay, he does have around a row of Frozen Series skins as well. I really do like the Polar Peely skin from the Frozen Series set. I think that this was a great addition to Fortnite. And yeah, it's so dope. Who doesn't like this skin? It's so fire. He has one Gaming Legend, the Kratos. This is a pretty mid skin. He also does have five Icon Series skins. The Lava Series, he has three of them. And he does have around two rows of Marvel Series skins as well. And he also does have a few Shadow Series skins. The Slurp Series. Does he have all the styles to the Slurp Series? We're obviously going to look. And sadly, boys, it looks like he actually doesn't have all the styles to the Slurp skin. The Galaxy Scout, the Gear Specialist. I really do like how he upgraded the Gear Specialist. I'm not going to lie. It looks very clean. I say this about a lot of the Gear Specialist skins that I see because a lot of them are actually really nice. And I think that most people deck it out pretty dopely oh he does have the glow skin of season 10 as well the oppressor and obviously guys the glow skin is a exclusive skin which is super dope the serana scientist ultimate knight vendetta very clean the vertex i wonder if he has a dark vertex because usually with accounts that have the vertex they do have the dark vertex as well it's not like a fact but that's just what i've seen with accounts with the vertex and yeah the dark vertex is one of my favorite exclusive skins the alpine ace which is very dope astro battle hawk beat boss very clean the demi dj yon Eternal Voyager, Fable, Giddy Up. Again, I hope that he has a Renegade Raider like he said he had. Because it was an expensive account. So I just hope I don't actually get scammed. The iconic skin, obviously, this is his exclusive skin that he has. I absolutely love this skin. It's super dope, honestly. And yeah, I mean, the iconic skin, very valid skin. What can I say? It's pretty rare, and not a lot of people obviously have it. The Jack Gordon, 
Jewels, Kit, Evergreen, Lucky Rider, Meow Schools, Merry Marauder, Very Clean, The Mission Specialist, the Peely. I love the Peely skin. It is one of my favorite skins in the game as well. It is just so dope and original. Yeah, you cannot go wrong with the Peely skin. I'm not gonna lie. The Rust Lord of Season 3, which is actually kind of rare as well. The Red Strike, Red Line, Reese, Sanctum, the Skull Trooper. We're gonna click Edit Style and see if he actually has the OG variant. Now, he didn't say that he actually had it, but I'm assuming that he might have it because he does have the Renegade Raider skin. But yeah, let's just check. Okay, sadly, he does not actually have the OG Skull Trooper, which is fine, but you know, I would really like to have it, but it's okay. Because you never know, he could still have the Renegade Raider. Fleshy Soldier, Sparkle Supreme, Stratus, Very Clean, The Trog, Vega, Wild, Willow, Lord, Yonder. This account is honestly pretty stacked so far. The Demogorgon, which is actually pretty rare. I've made a video on the rare skins in Fortnite, and the Demogorgon is actually on that list. It is extremely rare. It's not like an OG Season 1 skin, but I'm gonna tell you guys, this skin has not been out in a long time. And when it's actually out, no one really wants to buy it. It's kind of a trash skin, to be honest with you. And yeah, that's why it's so rare. The Maximilian, which is a skin that's very rare as well. Honestly, this account is pretty rare so far. So there's no way he won't have the Renegade Raider. The Remedy versus Toxin, Seawolf, Trilogy, Turk versus Riptide, Wooly Warrior, Yellow Jacket, very clean, the Armadillo, Aura, Bracer, High Rise, a Soul Trooper. This skin's actually pretty rare as well. I really don't see this skin that much either. A lot of the uncommon skins that you guys might see in videos that like you probably haven't seen in a while are extremely rare like the high rise like just skins like the scout too like you never see this skin i swear the red nose ranger par patroller and to end it off he is the yuletide ranger i'm gonna be reviewing my friend's og season one fortnite locker this is actually the best account you're ever gonna see oh uh, yeah that's cap it's kind of trash but like yeah, i literally have the aerial assault you're tripping yeah yeah i was joking i was joking but like still bro like the aerial assault is not that rare <laughs> no nah, nah, i'm joking i'm joking nah but for real bro this account is probably one of the most insane accounts i've ever seen so in today's video i'm gonna be reviewing it for you guys if you guys do want me to review your fortnite account for next video just shoot me a dm on twitter or instagram i'm putting my twitter and instagram up on the screen right now so go dm me if you guys obviously want me to review your account for another video also if you guys aren't subscribed i'd appreciate it if you guys could and yeah let's just get right into this video all right so kwanya bro like how did you actually get the aerial assault trooper because i bet all my subscribers are actually wondering because it is the rarest skin in the game basically it's season one you know i go into my mom's room peek in her wall it steal a credit card and then i went and bought a few skins Dude, is that actually what happened that's kind of funny i'm not gonna lie no, that's on god i didn't what? play fortnite after that for like three seasons because i was grounded but you know what that's actually funny i'm not gonna lie all right so we're gonna move right into the gliders guys to start off the locker tour so you probably have the mako glider correct just see for yourself bro oh, yeah i see the mako glider right there let's go what other gliders do you actually like in your collection that like you use all the time yeah i actually really like sir glider the brave i'm not gonna lie yeah bro i was actually just hovering over it this is probably one of my favorite gliders too it's actually insanely rare too oh and you also do have the get down glider of season two let's go that's actually pretty rare my favorite glider is actually the snowflake umbrella the snowflake oh you have the snowflake from season two? Oh, oh you course. do have it let's go all right kwanyar so we are now going to look at your pickaxe collection now i want to see how stacked your pickaxes are and what is your favorite pickaxe in your collection i mean bro based on your channel i think you know which one's my favorite and oh, just just find it for yourself is it the candy axe no way no way a little bit better than the candy axe you know what all right so you do have have two dark series pickaxes you have around three dc series that's pretty valid what's your favorite series set like marvel dc series frozen any of that you know i like the icon skins because i'm a big booga fan so oh okay okay i like booga too but i wouldn't say the icon yeah. are my favorite i probably like the marvel series the most but yeah it's, it's honestly preference marvel's pretty good the one uh black widow skin's kind of bad what wait hold up <laughs> wait what <laughs> all right the party animal the sludge hammer you have all the styles okay you didn't actually unlock all the styles to the sludge or pickaxe that's pretty uh, that's okay yeah. honestly yeah i couldn't play oh you couldn't play okay that makes, that makes sense you have the acdc of season two okay you're a season two player let's go season two get it right bro season one season one. Oh yeah you do have the aerial assault my bad my bad oh and you do have the bottom feeder i'm pretty sure the bottom feeder is rare right bro i got all the rare pickaxes i don't even know <laughs> all right bro all right you have the candy axe of course which is probably my favorite pickaxe in the game let's go you have the raiders revenge bro you didn't even <laughs> tell me that what yes bro you know me wait when did you get this pickaxe bro i don't even remember this bro <laughs> i got in season one of course right before i uh stole my mom's credit card so i actually bought that one myself 
off. Wait, wait. Did you actually steal your mom's credit card? Or is that a joke? Nah, that was, yeah, we don't, what? We don't talk bro, about it. Oh my gosh. About. You're actually suspicious, bro. <laughs> oh, you have the Axe Caliber as well, which is pretty good. The Axe Aroni. Balloon Axe. The Batsicle. Yo, the Batsicle's trash. I'm not going to lie. You agree? Yeah, I mean, I got all my earnings using the Batsicle, though. You did? Actually, how many earnings yeah. you got? I have $13.50. You know my subscribers think you're capping, bro. Like, come on now. You don't have any earnings. I'm sorry. Yes, I do, bro. I have $10 from cleaning my room one you time. You just said $13. $13, bro. What are you Hold on. About? I didn't finish. I didn't finish. And three dollars and fifty cents because I bet three dollars and fifty cents on my friend if a skin was gonna come out the next day. And it did. So yo, guys in the comment section down below, you guys think he's lying or what? Like, I don't know. I don't think he has any earnings. I'm not gonna lie. Do you remember all the times I literally dogged on you in a 1v1? Like, I don't want to hear it. I'm not even a pro player, bro. Like, come on. But who has OG skins? Who has OG skins? Yeah. Alright, alright, you win, bro. Yeah, you you win. Alright, bro. Alright, bro. Come on, bro. You don't you don't gotta make fun of me like that, man. I, I wish I had OG skins, but you know. Alright, you have the OG. OG Reaper Scythe of season one. So did you actually get the OG Reaper Scythe when it was like back in OG days or no? Oh, uh, guys, I think he just crashed. Wait, what's going on? Oh, uh, guys, we have a little problem. His uh, screen just crashed. I'm pretty sure his mom probably turned off his PC or something. <laughs> Before your Wi-Fi actually crashed, I was wondering, uh, where did you actually get the Reaper Scythe? Like, did you get it back in season one? You know what I mean? Yeah, I got it in season one. You got it back in like full season one. So you had it OG yep. and stuff. Full season one. It was oh, my second sick. pickaxe. Oh, okay. That's actually sick. That's sick. Yeah. yeah. Oh, do you like the Spectral Axe? The Spectral Axe is like one of my favorite pickaxes. Nah, that, that pickaxe is like noobs use that. What? What are you yeah, talking used... about? No, no. Do not say that about the Spectral Axe. You are literally disrespecting her right now. Nah, there was this dude I used to 1v1 and he'd always use the Spectral Axe. Oh, what was his bro. name? Like Ian Rocks or something. I'd Yo, smack what are you talking time. about? Nah, nah. Like, chill, bro. It's so bad. <laughs> dude, what are you talking about, bro? The Spectral Axe is so pickaxe. fire. Yeah, sure, sure, sure. All right. All right, let's keep going with this locker tour. You got a few more left. Nothing really too special that you shouldn't have. And to end it off, you got the default pickaxe. All right, Quanya. So your prize possession, all your skins. Are you ready to review it? So I'm going to do a quick little scroll, Quanya, so you can see. Dang, you got a lot of skins, bro. Oh, my gosh. Yes, sir. So is the Aerial Assault Trooper the only OG skin you actually have? I don't know, bro. I can't reveal that to your viewers. They just got to keep watching. I may even have unreleased skins. Wait, you have unreleased skins, bro? You're capping. What? There's no way. Oh. Bro, I would never cap like wait what do you actually <laughs> I don't know man all, all I can say is my last name's mustard and my dad's name is Donald so bro what no it's not <laughs> shut up bro it is, yes it is bro stop <laughs> you're capping bro get out of here all right starting from the top okay you got four dark series you got one DC okay you got three frozen series skins you didn't actually get the brand new frozen series set in the shop I mean it's not brand new but yeah you didn't get it, it just came out again do you like it yeah do like I do it's season? fire it's fire yeah yeah I think it's trash like noobs usually like that one, so. bro what are you talking about bro like what all right you got the gaming legend bro you only got one gaming legend series skin like come on man you, you got to step up your gaming legend stuff nah. what do you mean nah bro you don't like the gaming legend series do you like the gaming legend series yes of course so yeah always... bro, yeah it's a noob it's a noob set <laughs> what always... bro <laughs> why do you think everything's noob nah bro because you use it bro, bro it's you're obviously about to get bad. clowned in the comment section my subscribers love the gaming legend series skins i'm no, not even gonna count the subscribers literally like me better that is not nah bro that's too far too far you see how cute i am bro like Yo. okay you got like two rows of marvel series skins that's pretty valid. You like the Marvel series set, right? No. Why? What? Dude, every time I watch your videos, you're like, oh, I love the Marvel series set. That just makes me not want to wear it. That is so like, honestly, rude. That is so rude, Quanyo. I'm sorry, yeah, bro. Yeah. That is that is just rude, bro. Okay, you got the Black Knight of Season 2. This is really fire. I'm not going to lie, Quanyo. Thank you, thank you. Did you rock the Black Knight in Season 2? Uh, I mean, somewhat, but I was I was like kind of a Renegade Raider type of guy. Renegade Raider? I don't think you have the Renegade Raider, but... All right. Oh, yeah, I don't. I don't. What are you talking about? <laughs> what are you talking uh, about? I'll just, keep, just keep scrolling, bro. Like, okay, all right. The cattle. <laughs> List, crack shot okay dark vanguard the dark voyager of season three you like the dark voyager i'm pretty sure you used to wear that right yeah dark voyager goes hard it was like the best battle pass skin but now it's kind of trash but yeah, back then yeah, I, I agree the galaxy scout gear specials so let's just keep going through these until there's something cool um wow you got so many alpine aces bro why did you get so many of them like what did you just like want to waste money like bro you got so many man are you why are you being silent hello what bro why is he walking away wait what i don't want to talk about it bro dark times <laughs> what bro nah no way you spent that kind of money on Alpine Aces, bro. You said it was my money, bro. Yo, nah, 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 nah. We're gonna cut that out. Cut that out. Okay, we're gonna keep going through these. Oh, you have the OG skull. No way. Sir. Oh, you actually rocked the OG skull on your channel. This is like your main skin, right? All the time. OG skull trash, bro. Like, I'm not even gonna lie. I'm joking. I'm joking, bro. You know I'm joking. I'm joking, bro. Chill, chill. Say that one more time, Ian. I dare you. <laughs> what? Bro, did he just punch his camera? Bro, there's no way you just punch your camera over that. Nobody disses my skin like that, Ian. I'm actually sorry, bro. Like, for real, for real. Are you good? You good? You good? Dab me up. 
<laughs> and here is your prize possession, the aerial assault trooper. This is your rare skin, right? Yes, sir. Let's go. The well, aerial. Almost rare skin. Alm bro, you realize the aerial is the most rare in the game. Like, I don't know what you're saying. Like, what? Just keep watching. Just keep, they gotta all keep right, watching. All right, all right, all right. The blue squire of season two, of course. He has the break point, which is the pack from season nine. All right. Let's just keep going through these. I'm not really seeing. Oh, you do have the renegade. Why were you keeping that for me, bro? Bro, I had to make you wait. I had to make the viewers wait, make it more interesting, you know? Bro, I didn't even realize, dude. Like, I didn't actually know you had the renegade. Raider, like what? I've been in calls with you like 20 times, dude. I've, no, more than 20, like 100 times. You've never wore the Renegade Raider, like what? What do you mean? I literally have like a full montage of me just clipping you as the Renegade Raider. All right, dude, you got you got to stop. You got to stop saying that, bro. Like I'm being for real, man. Like you can't be saying that. <laughs> uh, okay, whatever, man. You you know who's better at Fortnite, bro? Like I'm not gonna lie. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. The Tart Tycoon, okay, which is an exclusive skin from the World Cup. You played the World Cup, right? I qualified. Qualified for uh, yeah. like the finals. Yeah, like in New York. Yeah, yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, totally. You're, you're capping. Yeah, right? I, I, re I rebranded. My old name is Clicks. <laughs> All right, buddy. Oh, you do have the World Warrior as well, which is like your last skin you have from the World Cup, of course. And then to end it off, you got the Yuletide Ranger. Okay. All right. So my final rating on my friend's Fortnite account is going to be a 9.8 out of 10. What are you, what are you sad about, bro? That's good, right? Want to add 0.2 more? No, it's not a 10 out of 10, bro. You didn't... Dude, okay, listen. Wanna be listen, that chair? Wanna listen, be that chair? Let, let me explain, bro. You had all the OG you were stacked, but you didn't have the OG gold trooper, and you didn't have a few more OGs, bro. Okay, that's fast. It was a really good locker. Like, we're good friends, bro. Like, I know we were just messing around the whole video, but like, for real, 9.8 out of 10 is probably gonna be your rating. I mean, it's a really good account, bro. Hey, right, I appreciate that. Yeah, 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 of course. I for real, like, appreciate you letting me be in the video. Like, I know I was being toxic. It was all jokes. Thank you so much. Yeah, yeah, of course, bro. We're all like, good friends. You guys could check him out in the comment section down below. He'll be like the first comment. We'll see what he says. I don't really know. But yeah, you guys should go subscribe to him he makes great content and also if you guys want me to review your account for next video dm me on twitter or instagram and yeah i'll get right back to you guys so yeah go dm me on there oh my gosh guys i didn't even see he literally has a renegade raider i thought this account could get any better Oh. In today's video, I'm going to be reviewing one of the most insane Season 1 Fortnite accounts. This account was actually sent in by one of my subscribers, and he told me that he has probably one of the best Fortnite accounts. He didn't tell me what skins he actually had, but he told me that they're really insane. Before I get into the video, please be sure to subscribe with all post notifications turned on. And yeah, I'm going to get right into this locker tour. Okay, guys, so I just clicked on his pickaxes. He has so many pickaxes. This account is actually going to be so stacked. Do you guys see this? Oh my gosh. All right, starting from the top. Here we go. The dark axe. We got the axe trail. Okay, we got the boxing glove axe. Okay, here we go. Oh my gosh. He has so many pickaxes. I don't know how I'm going to review all of these. Oh my gosh. The diamond axe. This is from the Travis Scott bundle, I'm pretty sure. But that's actually a sick axe. I actually love that. The old mate. Okay, we got the... Oh, these are all the um, Marvel. These are all the Marvel pickaxes, I'm pretty sure. We got the Slurp pickaxe. This is one. This was one of my main pickaxes back in Season 3. I actually missed Season 3. Let me know if any of you guys in the comment sections actually have the Slurp pickaxe. Because that was one of my main back in the day. The Sludge Hammer. This goes with that one Slurp skin, I'm pretty sure. We got the Raised Quarter Staff. That's sick. The ACDC. That's from Season 2. All right. You know he's already an OG. Oh my gosh. This is going to be insane. The Beast Fang, okay, okay. The Bite Mark, this is a very old pickaxe. I remember everyone used to use this, especially Ninja. I don't know if you guys remember that, but the Bottom Feeder, dude. This guy literally lives in Season 3 still. Oh my gosh, you guys see all these freaking OG pickaxes. The Death Valley, okay. The Disco Brawl. I literally remember when this uh, pickaxe launched. Dragon's Claw. We got the Dual Edge. I think that goes with the, the Drift skin in Season 5 or 4. I don't remember, but I think it goes with that. So that's sick. The Eon Blades, that's dope as well. Here we go. We got to go through a lot of these because he has so many. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. He has this. This is actually such a sick pickaxe. No way. The Merry Mint Axe. I wish I had that on my account, but... uh. I don't, I don't. <laughs> All right. The Oracle Axe, okay. The Permafrost. The Pulse. The Pink Squeak. I remember this pickaxe as well. That's such a sick pickaxe. A very old pickaxe as well. The Pink Flamingo. Brings me back to the OG days, that season two days. Wearing the Pink Flamingo every single day, going to Greasy Grove. The Pot of Gold. <gasps> Wait, there's no way. Guys, uh, he is the Raider's Revenge. Oh my gosh. This account is actually so insane. There's no way he has the Raiders Revenge. Oh my gosh, guys. Oh my god. I mean, if he has the Raiders Revenge, I mean, maybe he has the Renegade Raider. All right, let's just move on. That's actually insane, though, that he has the Raiders Revenge. Oh my gosh. Okay, here we go. The Renegade Roller. That's a sick pickaxe. 
the rift edge the skull sickle this goes with the the skull trooper i think this came out in like season six but uh yeah i remember this coming out that was actually so sick um the stardust strikers oh this matches the galaxy skin like crazy i've actually never seen this pickaxe but it matches the galaxy skin like crazy so that's pretty cool the swag smasher this pickaxe sucks like if you wear this pickaxe all my respect for you went completely down because this pickaxe is literally ginormous who in the heck is gonna wear this like come on the trusty number two. Oh my gosh this pickaxe was so sweaty in season three i don't know if you guys remember that but um here we go i'm just gonna scroll through a lot of them because there's so many oh my gosh guys the angler axes the axe caliber that's a season two pickaxe i remember that from the battle pass a balloon axe Bang shots, the Batsicle. I remember when the Batsicle and the Scythe, they were like, they were like competing which one was better. That was actually so funny. I remember that. The boulder, the bunker, the butterfly knives. Oh, that's so sick. There was like a little sparkle. That's so cool. Guys, I'm not going to lie to you. Like a quarter of these pickaxes, I've literally never seen. So this account is actually insane. I'm not even going to lie. The chill axe, the cliff hank too. There's so many pickaxes. Dude. The faded frame, um, the forebearer. The fresh fish, the frosty globes, the gelf, dude. There's so many, dude. Oh my gosh, guys. This is insane. This is actually insane. I can't wait to see these skins. Oh my gosh. Peely axe. That goes with the banana skin. That's actually so sick. The scythe pickaxe, of course, that goes with the skull trooper and gold trooper. OG pickaxe, man. It came out again, but still OG. This account is actually insane already, and I've only seen the pickaxes. Oh my gosh, guys. The mean streak, the old woody, the rose glow, the simple sledge, the tech axe, the throwable axe. The oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, guys. He has so many axes. Obviously, I didn't go through every single pickaxe he had because there were so many of them. But uh, yeah, that's just a little glimpse of all the pickaxes he actually had. So uh, yeah, let's just get into these skins. I know you guys are all waiting for this. As you guys can tell, this guy already put the Black Knight as the preset to this locker. So you know he's already OG. Let's just hope that he has Renegade Raider or Gold Trooper. Or even Purple Skull Trooper. Those all would be so cool. All right, here we go. Let's get into this locker. The Frozen Love Ranger. Here we go. The Frozen Raising. He has the whole Frozen set. He has the whole Lava set. Oh my gosh, guys. I am already feeling this account is going to be so insane. The Backlash. The Battle Hound. That is a very OG skin. The Black Knight. Oh my gosh, guys. No way. This is actually insane. Do you guys see all these legendary skins he has? The Drift skin. Okay. The Eternal Knight. The Fade skin. Skin, the fly trap i i've always hated this skin this skin is actually terrible but no hate to this account but i just don't like that skin the frostbite the fusion the galaxy scout the gear specialist the havoc oh my gosh guys the hybrid the leviathan the love ranger the lux the lynx the magnus the midas i love i actually loved the midas season that was probably one of my favorite seasons i don't think it beat season two or season one if you guys like the henchman season but yeah that was probably one of my favorite omega the omen the power cord um the ragnarok raptor raven raz red knight oh my <laughs> guys this account is crazy oh my gosh i'm just waiting for those og skins to come up oh my gosh the rock sentinel dude there's so many oh my gosh the reaper skin the visitor the tricera op the vendetta that's a pretty cool skin the war paint the wukong okay dude there's so many dude the dark bomber the dark red knight the dark wild card he has the whole dark set which is pretty cool he also has the whole dc series and oh my god he has the whole astro world series too and the ninja skin. Oh, if I thought it couldn't get any better, this guy's the whole entire Marvel set. Are you kidding me? This guy has had to spend like around 20 grand on this account. This is actually insane. Abstract, Agent Jonesy, Agent Peely. This guy is four of the Alpine Aces. What the heck? Dude, what? The Astra, the Battle Hawk, the Beef Boss. Dude, oh my gosh, guys. There is literally so many skins. The Chaos Agent, that is a very sweaty skin. I used to rock that skin on my main account, but not anymore. He also has this set. I don't remember what it's called, but he has like the 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 Hush, the Wild Card, and the Chaos Agent pack. I don't know if you guys remember that pack, but uh, yeah. The Dusk, the Elite Agent, the Ember, the Fable, the Fireworks Team Leader. I don't know if you see this, but this is a Gold Trooper. I am hoping that it is a pink Gold Trooper. That would be absolutely insane. I'm going to click on it in three, two, one. Oh, oh my gosh, guys. He literally has the OG Gold Trooper. I thought this account couldn't get any better. 
Oh my gosh, guys. This account is actually so stacked. Imagine if we had Renegade Raider too. That would actually be so insane. I've literally never even seen the Renegade Raider. The Giddy Up, the Ginger Gunner, the Grind, the Heidi, the Highland Warrior, the Honor Guard. Oh my gosh. That skin is so rare. I've literally never seen that skin in game. No way. I, I think this is probably one of the best Fortnite accounts I've ever seen already. I literally haven't seen like half the skins and it's already mo like the most insane I've ever seen. Oh, and he has the iconic skin, dude. What? This is actually nuts. I've literally never seen something like this. The Isabel skin, the jewels, the lace skin, the evergreen the man cake the meow schools mary marauder mission specialist guys this guy has literally like five mogul masters why in the heck would you need five mogul masters the moonwalker a season three skin this is one of my favorite season three skins the nightlife the nightshade ocean onesie party mvp peely skin the powder skin rabbit raider rapscallion red strike red line the rook Rust Lord, that's a season three skin. That's one of the coolest ones. Um, the Jonesy skin, Sergeant Winter, Shade, Shadow Ops, Sidewinder, Fiona. Here we go, guys. I'm hoping he'll have the purple skull trooper. I see it right here. Let's just click on it, man. Oh my gosh, guys. If I thought this account was gonna get any better, he has the OG goal, the skull, and he has the renegade raider pickaxe. If this guy does in fact have the renegade raider, this will be the best account on Fortnite. Sparkle specialist, that's a season two skin. Let's go, baby. Flash specialist, spooky team leader, squad leader, TNT, Tina. That's a cool skin as well. The tomato head. Dude, we're still on the blue skins. How are we still on blue skins? I swear, we've been scrolling for like an hour now. Oh my gosh, dude. The Vega, the Ventura, the Venturion. He's got to have around like 500 skins, I swear. The Absolute Zero Beach Bomber, Bigfoot, Blue Squire. That's the Season 2 skin. It's an absolutely sick skin. The Blue Team Leader, Brawler, Breakpoint, Brilliant Striker, Bright Bomber, the Clinical Crosser, the Codename Elf, the Cozy Chomp, Cryptic, Dazzle, Desperado, Double Cross, Dream, Dummy, the Dynamic Dribbler, the Dynamo, the Echo, the Fastball, the Finetude. I can't even keep count of all the skins. This is actually insane. The First Strike Specialist, the Fish Stick, the Focus, the Gingerbread Raider. That is a sign that we are in fact gonna get the Renegade Raider on this account. There is absolutely no way we don't. Like, come on now. There's literally so many skins, bro. Look at these, dude. <laughs> Look at all of them, bro. There's so many. He has so many skins, bro. This guy's definitely been playing forever. Like, come on now. Oh my gosh. Guys, I didn't even see. He literally has a Renegade Raider. Oh my. This is this has to be the best account I've ever seen. This guy literally has the Renegade Raider. That is actually so insane. Let's go, baby. Hey, subscriber out there. You have probably the best Fortnite account I've ever seen. This is actually nuts. I can't believe you had the Renegade Raider, guys. That's actually nuts. No way, dude. And it just keeps going, man. The Zadie, the Aspen. Here, we're finally on the green skins. Oh my gosh. The Aura, the Birdie, the Bunny Moon, the Commando, the Crimson, the Crystal, the Devastator, the Dominator, the High Rise Soul Trooper, the Jungle Scout, the Light Show, the Manic, the Marked Marauder. Dude, when does it stop, bro? I swear, when does it stop, dude? There's so many, dude. The Nogoffs, the Red Jade, the Red Nose Ranger, the Renegade. I'm just gonna show you guys how long it takes for me to scroll on these emotes. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Do you guys see how many emotes he has? Oh my gosh. This is unreal. I've literally never been on a more stacked Fortnite account. Okay, that was actually so insane. So all we're gonna search up is Fortnite accounts OG skins. So I already found an account and it says OG Fortnite account legendary and rare skins and OG pickaxes. And it also does have OG gliders and I could get this account for around $227. Now that is a pretty good deal considering that it is an OG account. And yeah, $200 for the Renegade Raider is honestly really good. And yeah, this is a very good account to buy, but I wanna keep looking to see if there's any other accounts because I bet there's gonna be more accounts that might be even better so here's a black knight account that's going for 500 dollars. i would say this is kind of overpriced but yeah this is another account we could buy but yeah i don't know it's kind of overpriced though now i found another account that goes for 150 dollars, and yes guys it is a renegade raider account now the renegade raider goes for definitely more than 150 dollars. but yeah if i can get an account with the renegade raider for 150 dollars, that would be an absolute steal and if you guys can see in the picture it does have the og gold trooper but again this does look really sketchy like the picture does not look full quality 
I don't know, guys. It just looks really sketchy. So I don't know if I'm actually going to buy this account. But yeah, I'm just going to look a little bit more to see if there's anything else we could get that's decently rare or even anything cool. Okay, guys. So I just found an account and this account goes for $50. Now you guys won't believe it, but it literally says stacked Fortnite account with the purple skull trooper and the renegade raider. Now I've never gotten an account for that cheap that actually had the renegade raider and the OG skull. So that would be insane if it actually had OG skins on it for $50. But yeah, in the picture, it does show an OG skull trooper. So it might actually be legit. You know what, guys? I just think I'm going to buy this account for the video. So I guess I'll just catch you guys in the locker. Starting off with this locker, we already have an OG skull trooper. Now this is already a perfect sign that this account is actually going to have OG skins. So we are actually going to look at the gliders that he has. So let's actually see if he has the Mako glider of season one. And let's go. He does actually have the Mako glider of season one. Now he also does have the snowflake umbrella, which is the umbrella that he had equipped of season two. So yes, this is a season two exclusive umbrella. It is actually pretty rare. And yeah, he does have it equipped, which is pretty dope. He also does have the wet paint of season four as well. He must have the paper parasol. Yes, guys, he does have the paper parasol of season three. But yeah, let's see if he has any other rare gliders. He must have the sparkle specialist glider. I'm pretty sure he would have it. Yes, guys, he does have it. So he does have the get down glider of season two, which is from the season two battle pass, of course. But yeah, that's pretty dope, honestly. He does have the high octane as well and the slipstream, which is from the Twitch Prime set and the cloud strike, which is pretty dope. He definitely bought this a long time ago, to be honest with you. But yeah, he does have one gaming legend, two icon, and two Star Wars. But yeah, I don't know if I'm seeing anything else that cool. The Rickety Runner is pretty cool, I guess. But uh, yeah, you guys could obviously pause if you guys want to see all the other gliders he has. And let's just move on to the pickaxes. So he actually does have loads of pickaxes. I cannot wait to review this. Maybe he'll have like the Raiders Revenge or anything super rare. Because you know, this is an OG account because he did have the purple skull. So let's just get right into this pickaxe locker. So he does have one DC series, one Frozen, one gaming. He also does have the sludge hammer. We're going to click edit style. Let's actually see if he has all the styles to the sludge hammer pickaxe. And sadly, he does not have all the styles to it. It's honestly fine, though. He does have the ACDC of season two as well, which is from chapter one, season two, of course. And yes, the ACDC is one of the rarest pickaxes in the game. This goes hand in hand with the Black Knight skin, just like with rarity and stuff like that. So I'm pretty sure he will have the Black Knight if he has the ACDC, which is honestly pretty dope. And I can't wait to see the Black Knight. The Candy Axe of season one. One, Chomp Jr., Crystal X of Masters, the Death Valley, which is actually pretty rare. If you guys don't know, the Death Valley is actually one of the rarest pickaxes in the game, just item shop pickaxes. I don't think this has been in the shop in like a thousand days, which is pretty insane, honestly. Like a thousand days is literally like three years ago, which is pretty crazy. Oh, he does have the Merriman Tax, which is actually my favorite pickaxe in the game. Let's go. If you guys watch my channel, you guys know that I love the Merriman Tax. I say it in literally like every single one of my videos with the Merriman Tax. And he does have the Evo of Season 3. The Permafrost of Season 5, Rainbow Smash, a Reckoning, Rift Edge of Season 5, The Scorcher of Season 7, Scratch Mark, Snake Sword, Solar Slicer, Stringle, 6 Carry Cutter, very dope. He also does have the Angler Blades, the Axe Caliber, which is another Season 2 exclusive pickaxe. Let's go. The Breathless Blades, Bunker Basher, Chaos Scythe, Cosmic Cleavers, Crimson Axe, Dive Knives, Crowbar, very clean. He also does have the Hack Smash. Let's just keep going through these guys because obviously a lot of the pickaxes get boring when we get to the blue slash red rare pickaxes. Oh, the Pulse Axe is a Season 2 exclusive as well. The Snake Bite, Sparkle Scythe. Here are the Sweaty Pickaxes. He has the Star Wand, Studded Axe, the Driver, the Gladius, Icebreaker. Those are all pretty much Sweaty Pickaxes. The Old Woody, Rose Glow, Silent Strike, Throwback Axe. So we are getting to the bottom of this list. So he has a Tree Splitter. And to end off this Pickaxe Locker, he has the default Pickaxe. Before we actually look at the skins, we are going to look at the emotes he has. So he does have a decent amount of emotes as well. Now off the bat, I already saw that he did have the Fresh emote. This this emote hasn't been out in over a thousand days, which is actually insane. But yeah, I'm obviously not going to go through every single emote. I'm just going to go through the ones that are kind of rare or even decently rare. Because, you know, we would literally be here all day if I went through every single emote. The Worm of Season 2, which is an exclusive Season 2 emote. The Take the L is from Season 3 as well. Very dope emote. The Pure Salt is a very rare emote as well. But yeah, let's see if he has the Floss emote. Yes, guys, he does have the Floss emote of Season 2. Let's go. The Floss emote is one of the rarest emotes in the game, and it's actually insane. I mean, like, this emote's so dope, insane, it's rare, like, who doesn't love this emote? But yeah, he also does have the calculated, oh, I just saw the robot of season 3 as well. He also does have 4 icon series, 1 Marvel, and 1 gaming legend. 
I really do like the maneuvers from the Gaming Legend series set as well. It's pretty dope. Oh, he does have the breakneck as well, which is a pretty dope emote as well. Also, if you want to pause the video, here are all his traversal emotes, and here are all his synced emotes, and here are all his favorite if you guys want to see them. So he does actually have loads of skins. I cannot wait to review this skin locker. Now, again, he does apparently have the Renegade Raider skin, so I cannot wait to see that. Starting from the top, he has the Frozen Peely, the one Gaming Legend. He also does have like around a row of Marvel series skins, which is really not that much. But again, we are just looking for the rare skins, so I'm not really that upset about it. And yes, guys, here's the Black Knight, the first rare skin that he has on his account. But yeah, this is actually going to be so dope. I cannot wait to see all the rare skins he has. The Black Heart, Calamity, Carbide, Catalyst, Crack Shot, Dark Voyager of Season 3, pretty rare as well. The Dire Drift, Enforcer, Eternal Knight, the Gear Specialist, so he actually didn't upgrade the Gear Specialist. The Havoc, which is a Twitch Prime skin, let's go. This is actually a pretty rare skin. People don't know that it's rare, but yes, guys, this skin is actually rare. The Midas, Omega, does he have all the styles to the Omega? He does actually have every single style to the Omega. The Warpaint, Wukong, Zenith, Abstract, Agent Jones, the Nick A30 skin, the Alpine Ace, of course, the Elite Agent of Season 3, very clean. This is actually a pretty rare skin as well. The Fable of Season 6, Giddy Up, Gumbo, Harlow, Haven, Huntress, the Jewels, the Kit. This is honestly a skin from a battle pass that I just really do not like. I don't know. There's just something about it that is just not that good. It's honestly too bulky. It's just crazy. I don't know, guys. I don't really like this skin. Oh, he also does have the Mogul Master as well. Let's go. The Meowskulls. I really do like this version of the Meowskulls. I don't really like the kit, but I do like the Meowskulls. He doesn't actually have it fully golden too, which is kind of an L, but it still is a dope skin. The Mogul Master, Moonwalker, Nara, Nightshade, Nightbeam, Rogue Agent, which is actually one of the first packs to ever come out in Fortnite. The Scourge, Scrimmage Scrapper, the Sergeant Winter, Sidewinder, Siona. Here is the OG Skull Trooper of Season 1. Let's go. So yes, guys, this is actually an OG skin. You guys obviously should know that by now. If you guys even play Fortnite, like the OG Skull Trooper is one of the rare skins in the game. Oh, he does have the Sparkle Specialist as well. Let me know down below if you guys do like the Sparkle Specialist or not. And if you have it, because I'm honestly curious who has the Sparkle Specialist who watches my videos. Because again, this skin is actually very rare. So yeah, comment down below if you guys do have the Sparkle Specialist skin. Or if you like the Sparkle Specialist skin, honestly, any comment is cool. The Sun Strider, Tarana, Technique, the Ace Tilted Technique, the Toxic Trooper, Trailblazer, another series set pack skin, which is pretty rare. The Wingman, another set pack that's rare. The Yule Trooper, the Absolute Zero. This skin is pretty trash, honestly. The Blue Squire of Season 2, let's go. He also does have the Chromium, the Dynamo, Fish Stick, the Poised Playmaker, Recon Expert. I honestly wonder if he got the Recon Expert OG, because again, he does have it. And yeah, the Recon Expert did re-release, so you never know if he actually did have the Recon Expert OG, because it did actually used to be OG. And yeah, it did actually used to be the rare skin in the game. It's honestly pretty crazy, but yeah. The Royal Knight, which is another Season 2 rare skin. Let's go. Special Forces, another rare skin. The Tar Tycoon, another exclusive skin. Yeah, this account is honestly stacked with rare and exclusives. It's pretty crazy. The Assault Trooper, Desert Dominator, Garrison, Recon Ranger, Red Jade, Renegade, Scarlet Commander, the Jolly Jammer. I actually love this skin as well. The Heron Stance Hero, which is another skin that's really dope. I really do enjoy the Cobra Kai set. It is actually so dope, guys. I'm not even gonna lie. The Star Spangled Ranger. This is a skin that actually used to be rare as well. The Whiplash of Season 3. Let's go. And he also does have the World Warrior, which is an exclusive skin. You could only get it in the Fortnite World Cup of 2019. This rich subscriber probably has the most insane account I've ever seen. Yo, guys. So in today's video, I'm gonna be reviewing my subscriber's insanely stacked Fortnite account. So as you guys can see, he is actually rocking the Renegade Raider skin, which is obviously an OG skin. Now, he actually showed me a video of his account over on Twitter. No, I'm gonna say this is probably one of the best accounts I've ever looked at. If you guys want me to review your Fortnite account for next video, DM me on Twitter or Instagram. Just literally shoot me a DM and I'll answer right away. If you guys aren't subscribed yet, please consider subscribing. And yeah, let's just get right into this video. So to start off these locker tours, I actually do start off with the gliders. And obviously we are gonna be looking for the Mako glider, but we're gonna do a quick little scroll of all the gliders he actually has. Now, wow, he actually does have a lot of gliders, boys. Like, look at all the gliders he actually has. So obviously we're gonna look for the Mako glider and let's go. There is the Mako glider of season one. This is honestly one of my favorite gliders in the game. We're gonna look and see if he has anything else though. Okay, he does have the Sir Glider the Brave of season two as well. Let's go. Okay, we're gonna keep looking. Oh, he has the Get Down Glider of season two. We're gonna look for anything else. Look at all the series gliders he has though. This is actually crazy. Okay, I really do like the Soaring Soul Self. I said that in the last video. Oh, he has the Sumo Torpedo, which actually just came out. This is a very dope glider as well. Oh, and he does have the Wingspan as well, which goes with LeBron James set. Yeah, honestly, a very stacked glider locker. I'm not gonna 
lie, boys. Okay, guys, so we're gonna move right into the pickaxes, and he actually does have an insane amount of pickaxes. Now, as you guys can see, he was actually rocking the ACDC pickaxe when I was in the menu. And yeah, this is probably in the top three rarest pickaxes of all time, because as you guys know, it is a season two exclusive pickaxe. So yeah, we're just gonna start right from the top. So it looks like he has two dark series pickaxes. Oh my gosh, this guy must have every single DC series pickaxe. That is actually nuts. Like, wow, look at all these pickaxes he has. Like, no way. And he has four frozen series pickaxes, which is pretty valid. I'm not gonna lie. And it also does look like he has around like two rows of gaming legend. And wow, he has a lot of icon series too. I really do like the lion pickaxe. It goes with the LeBron James set and the PWR slicers, which is very dope as well. The Booga blades are probably my favorite icon series pickaxe, but I don't really know. That's just my favorite right now. And yeah, look at all the Marvel series he has. And my favorite Marvel series at the moment is actually the brand new Spider-Man pickaxe. It's probably not gonna be my favorite forever, but yeah, it's just the one that I've been rocking recently just because the new season and everything. Okay, he has the Loki Spectre as well, which is very clean in my opinion. Okay, it looks like he has three Shadow Series pickaxes. And there is the ACDC pickaxe of season two. Let's go, man. This is actually a very dope pickaxe. I mean, he does have the Candy Axe as well. He must have the Merry Mint Axe then. So obviously, guys, a lot of these are kind of boring and I just don't really care about a lot of these. So we're just gonna keep going through these until we find something cool. Yo, the Demon Slayer Blade is actually so cool. I don't really see this that much. The Eva, let's go. He actually does have the Eva. Oh, and the Hammerhead Morty of last season. So it actually looks like he doesn't have the Merry Mint Axe because it would be like right around here. But he does have the Minty Mountaineer. So it looks like he actually didn't get his hands on the first Minty set, which is honestly pretty sad. But yeah, the same thing happened to me where I didn't actually get the Minty Pickaxe. And yeah, I actually bought the Minty set after it first released. Yeah, the Minty Axe is so dope though. Yo, the Plasma Carrot. This is such a dope pickaxe. I barely see this pickaxe, but like look at the customizable features of this pickaxe. I think that this is really dope and it could match so many skins. Oh, he does have the Stellar Axe of Season 6 as well. The Big Spoon, Fret Basher, Torrens Light Blade, Triple Mint Skepter, Trusty Number 2, which is from Season 3, obviously. The Axe Caliber of Season 2. Let's go. So we're just gonna keep going through these because a lot of these are kind of boring. So we're just gonna keep going through them. Oh, he has the Gum Brawler, which just came out. This is very dope in my opinion. This is actually a Chapter 3 pickaxe. The Pickaxes as well. And the Smash Room. The Spike Bat, which is pretty dope. It is from Chapter 3. Let's go. And he does have the Vision, which is a very sweaty pickaxe. The Ancient Staff. Let's go. And he does actually have the Golden Pigskin from Season 6. Okay, so it looks like we're now in the Uncommon Pickaxes. So yeah, we're just gonna keep going through these until we find something cool. Oh, he has the Simple Sledge. Honestly, guys, this pickaxe is actually really underrated. I honestly love this pickaxe. I think it is actually so dope. The Twin Blades, you shouldn't have. And to end it off, he has the Default Pickaxe. Okay, guys, so before I actually do look at the skins, I want to show you guys the emotes he actually has. Now, he has an insane amount of emotes, probably the most stacked emote locker I've ever seen. Like, look at all the emotes he actually has. This is actually unreal. The one thing I wanted to mention is all the icon series emotes he has. He must have bought in every single icon series emote. That is, like, insane. I'm not even gonna lie, guys. I've never seen this many icon series emotes. Like, I'm not even gonna lie. Yeah, it's actually crazy. So, we are gonna look for rare emotes, obviously. The first one is the Rambunctious. Yes, sir. He does have the Rambunctious. Debatably, the rarest emote in the game. Let's go. And we obviously are gonna type in the Floss emote. And, of course, he does actually have the Floss and the Windmill Floss. Okay. And also, we're gonna look for the Rar emote, which is really rare. He doesn't have that. Let's look up Fresh. And, yes, sir, he does have the Fresh of Season 1. Very rare. But, yeah, he has so many more rare and stacked emotes. Like, it's actually crazy, guys. Like, there's so many. Okay, guys, so we're gonna move right along into the skins. Now, he actually does have an insane amount of skins. This is definitely what you guys are all waiting for. But, yeah, like, look at all the skins he actually has. So we're just gonna start from the top. So he has a three dark series skins and it looks like he has almost every single DC series skin. Now, honestly, it looks like he doesn't have the brand new DC series skins in the shop, but yeah, he has like almost every single DC series skin. That is actually crazy. And he has around two rows of frozen series skins. Honestly, a row and a half, but yeah. And he has two rows of gaming legend and three rows of icon, which is very dope. The major laser is probably one of the least popular icon series skins in my opinion. And the Marco Roos, which he has. And he has the blaze. Okay, he has five. Five lava series. Look at all the Marvel series skins he actually has. This has to be one of the most stacked Marvel series lockers I've ever seen. He even has Carnage. Like, look at this. He has Spider-Man 2 and Thanos. Leo. there's no way. And he has the Venom 2. Let's go. And it also looks like he has almost all the Slurp series skin set. The Aim Alley. It also looks like we are now out of the series set skin. Yo, he has the Black Knight, which is actually a very rare and exclusive skin. Let's go, man. As you guys know, the Black Knight is extremely rare. If you have the Black Knight, you are obviously lucky. He has the Carbide of Season 
four. Okay. Crack shot, cuddle team leader. The Galaxy Scout. So he has all three of the Galaxy Girl skins. Obviously, they aren't really rare, but yeah. The boy Galaxy is obviously rare, though. You can see Omega of season four, too. Let's go. And the Magnus. The Magnus is a skin that's honestly kind of common, but like I never see it. Like I thought that a lot of people bought this skin in season five, but I don't know. I don't really see it that much. The Oppressor, too. This is kind of a trash skin, in my opinion. The Power Cord, Red Knight, Wreck, Spider Knight, Spire Assassin, Tempest, Cube Queen, which is from Chapter 2, Season 8. The Reaper, which is from Season 3. Very OG. And honestly, pretty rare to see. So he has three Alpine Ace skins, and he does have the Astro Assassin of Season 9. As you guys know, the Astro Assassin is a very rare exclusive skin. And yeah, honestly, it's one of my favorite looking exclusive skins. Like, it's such a fire skin, in my opinion. I would honestly rank this in my top 10 favorite skins. I'm not even gonna lie. Okay, he has a lot of skins. Let's just keep going through these. He has the Double Agent set as well, and the Dread Fate, and the Dread Omen. The Elite Agent of Season 3. This is honestly, like, the first skin from the sweaty era of Fortnite. I'm not gonna lie. This, like, started the whole sweaty era. The Fabio from last season. The Fresh Aura. Okay. The Flow. He also does have the Boy Galaxy skin, which is probably the rarest skin we've seen so far. You know, it might not be rarer than the Black Knight, but yeah, let's go, man. He has the Galaxy skin of Season 4. Let's go. Galaxy skin of Season 5. My bad, guys. He also does have the Gold Trooper. We're gonna click Edit Style. Let's actually see if he has the purple pink variant to the Gold Trooper. And sadly, it looks like he actually doesn't have the purple pink variant to the Gold Trooper. Okay, he's the Gilded Guy as well. Honestly, though, it's fine that he doesn't have that because obviously he does have the Renegade Raider. And yeah, I don't know if he has more OG or rare skins. So we're just gonna keep going through them. Okay, he has the Mecha Morty, the Meow Skulls, Mary Marauder, the Mogul Master. Oh my gosh, look at all the Mogul Master skins he has. He has almost a row and a half of Mogul Masters. That is actually insane. The Nitro Jerry. This is honestly a pretty Mimi skin. I really like it. He has like a lot of Peely skins too. He's a Peely Bone, Peely, and the Peely with the threes in the tech. Okay, this is a pretty funny meme skin too. Okay, so he also does have the Skull Trooper. We're gonna click Edit Style and see if he actually has the purple variant. I'm honestly hoping he'll have the purple variant, but yeah, you never know. So yeah, click Edit Style. Let's go, guys. Oh, he actually does have the purple variant to the Skull Trooper. No way. Yo, that's actually insane. So that's the rarest item we've seen on his account so far. Let's go. He actually does have the purple variant to the Skull Trooper. Yes, sir. Snow Mando, Sophia, Sparkle Specialist of Season 2. Okay. The Tarana Technique, the Ace. Okay, he's the Unpeely too. He has so many Peely skins. I just realized, guys. And he does have the Cruel skin, which is honestly a pretty cool skin. Pretty unique, too. I really like how it's like a remake of the Tomato skin, but just better. The Blue Squire of Season 2. Very rare, guys. So we are in the rare skins now. Let's see if he has anything super uncommon or rare, obviously. Follow a lot of Fish Stick skin, which is pretty cool. The Headlock. I never see this skin. I'm not gonna lie. Pinky, this is honestly one of my least favorite skins in the game. It's just trash, and there's literally like no styles to it. It's just not that good. He does have the Recon Scout. I'm pretty sure this is actually really rare, and yes, sir, there is the Renegade Raider skin. Very rare and exclusive, and obviously OG. This is debatably the rarest skin in the game. It is head-to-head -head with the Aerial Assault Trooper. The Scrap Knight Jewels. Okay, the Seeker, Skeletra, Skull Ranger, the Sparkle Skull. I really do like the Sparkle Skull. It's actually really dope. Okay, the Mummy. We're just gonna keep going through them. Wave Ripper, Yellow Jacket, Yuki. So it looks like we are now in the Uncommon Skins. We're getting down to the bottom of this list. Let's see if he has anything else rare, though. The Envoy, Hawk Classic, Hopscotch, Icon, Recon Ranger, the Nog Ops, Champion, okay. The Tower Recon Specialist, Whiplash, Whiska, Wild Streak 1, and to end it off, he has a Yuletide Ranger. So yeah, to end it off, he had the Renegade Raider, the OG Skull Trooper, and the Galaxy Skin. So obviously, he had more exclusive and OG skins, but those are definitely the rarest skins I saw on his account. Alright, guys, so this account is gonna actually get a 10 out of 10. Now, I would say this is in my top two most insane lockers I've ever seen. Like, I can't believe how stacked an OG this account actually was. Like, it is actually unreal how stacked it is, guys. I, I actually can't believe it. But yeah, this is getting a solid 10 out of 10, guys. And yeah, I never give lockers a 10 out of 10. But yeah, this is getting a 10 out of 10. Yo guys, so in today's video, we're gonna be reviewing this Epic Employees Insanely Stacked Fortnite account. Yes guys, you heard me right, we're actually gonna be reviewing an Epic Employees Fortnite account. So this account was actually sent in to me on Twitter by an Epic Employee. Again, if you guys want me to review your Fortnite account for next video, DM me on Twitter. So yeah, I'm gonna be reviewing this locker today. Quickly, before I start the video, be sure to subscribe with all noties on. Literally less than half you guys who actually watch my videos are subscribed. So subscribing helps out so much. 
much. Why not subscribe? It's literally free. Okay, without further ado, guys, let's just get right into this video. Okay, guys, so to start off the locker tour, we're gonna look at the gliders. So we're just gonna do a quick little scroll, and it looks like he actually does have a lot of gliders. Honestly, more than the average glider collection. Definitely a lot of gliders. It looks like he has a lot of DC series gliders as well, which is pretty dope. But as you guys know, we're gonna try to find the makeup glider because it's obviously the most important glider. Sadly, it looks like he doesn't actually have the makeup glider, but it's honestly fine because it won't hurt his rating that much. But it is kind of important to have it, but it's really not the biggest deal. And he also does have the galaxy glider, so this means he might actually have the galaxy skin. Yo, there's no way. That's actually such a rare skin. And look at all the Marvel series gliders this guy actually has as well. Okay, guys, so we're moving on to the pickaxes now. We're just gonna do a quick little scroll of all the pickaxes he actually has. Okay, so he actually does have a lot of pickaxes. Wow, guys, look at all the pickaxes he actually has. So we're just gonna have to start from the top. So it looks like he has three dark series pickaxes. And oh my gosh, it looks like he has almost 20 DC series pickaxes, which is absolutely insane, bro. Like, look at all of these pickaxes. And it also looks like he has around five gaming legend series pickaxes. And he also does have a lot of icon series pickaxes as well. I also do really like the lion pickaxe. I think it is so sick. And I really do like the marshy smasher as well. He also does have one lava series pickaxe. Oh my gosh, look at all the Marvel series pickaxes this guy actually has as well. It literally fills up the whole entire screen, bro. Look at this, guys. I really do like the side blade. I think it is so sick. And he also does have the energy blade, which is one of my favorite Marvel series pickaxes as well. He also does have three shadow series pickaxes, which is pretty dope. The Aquari axe. I've actually never seen this pickaxe. It kind of looks like the sludge axe. And it looks like he actually does have all the styles to the sludge axe as well. Let's go. So it looks like we are now out of the set pickaxes. So we're just gonna keep looking and find anything cool. He does have the beef bone. I actually really do like this pickaxe. I think it's super dope. The breezy bashers. Here we go. We're just gonna keep going through these. He has the dread oracle axe. The dual edge eon blades epic swords of wonder. The hammerhead morty which was in the last battle pass. He also does have the pink flamingo which is actually a season one pickaxe. Obviously it's not rare anymore but it is a season one pickaxe. He also does have the pot of gold. I really do like this pickaxe as well. I always wear it during St. Patrick's Day. The popcorn. So it looks like we are seeing a lot of epic pickaxes right now. The Stardust Strikers, which is a galaxy skin pickaxe. It goes with the set, obviously. The Fret Basher, Glass Daggers, Vox Fang, Vox Main, Chain Blade, the Abominable Axe, Angler Axes. We're just gonna keep going through these guys because obviously some of these pickaxes we've already seen before in lockers. And they're honestly really boring, but he literally has so many pickaxes, guys. The Frosty Globes, Gilded Skeptor, Gold Crow, the Hack Smash, Highlight Strikers, Identity Disc. He also does have this pickaxe. I've actually never seen this pickaxe either. I don't even know if this release in the item shop. I've literally never seen this pickaxe. I don't know if I'm stupid or something, but like, I've never seen this. The Plunger, which is actually the Ninja pickaxe. Ninja actually used to rock this. The Reaper, Rebel Authority, Regal Roof. He also does have the Spectral Axe, which is one of my favorite pickaxes in the game. The Light, Spring Breaker, Star Wand, Starstruck Axe. The Street Blade, Studded Axe, Swamp Slicer, Tactical Quacks, Entune Bells, the Tide Axes. We're almost getting to the bottom of this list, guys. The Banana Axe. We're now on the Uncommon Pickaxes, obviously, guys. We have the Fresh Cut, the Warhammer, Ult and Sorrow, Old Woody, Palm, the Rainbow Carver, which is actually a very dope pickaxe. Again, I've only seen this on a few lockers, but this guy actually does have a lot of pickaxes that I've never seen. Well, maybe a few, obviously, but this is actually super dope, guys. The Silver Strikers, the Sledge. This is actually a pretty meme pickaxe as well. Thorn Throwback Axe. We're not getting to the bottom of this, so we got the Ultra Sight, the Vivid Axe, and to end it off, we got the default pickaxe. Like, that was actually a very good pickaxe locker. Now, I am so excited to check out these skins because I bet it's going to be even better and more stacked. And remember, guys, this is an epic employee Fortnite account. Oh my gosh, wait, this guy actually has so many skins. Look at all the skins he actually has. Yo, I know this one's going to be crazy, guys. Oh my gosh, he must have over 500 skins. So we're just going to start from the top. So it looks like he has around eight Dark Series skins, which is pretty crazy, honestly. It looks like he bought every single one. Oh my gosh, look at all the DC Series skins this guy actually has as well. This guy might have the most stacked DC Series locker I've ever seen. I'm not even kidding, guys. And look at all the Gaming Legend Series skins he actually has as well. Oh my gosh. And he also does have so many Icon Series skins. Oh my gosh. He must have every single one. But I've seen every single other Icon Series skin on this list. Oh my gosh. And he also does have almost every single Lava Series skin as well. I knew the Marvel Series skins were gonna be crazy. He must have over 30 Marvel Series skins. Oh my gosh. This is actually crazy. He does have the Raven Pool. I don't see this one a lot either. Boys, this is actually nuts though. Like, he literally has almost every single
single one. He also does have a lot of Shadow Series skins. I actually don't see all of these all the time either. So it looks like we are now out of the set skins. And we're just going to look at all the other skins he actually has. So he does have the Slurp skin. He does actually have all the styles to it as well. Let's go, bro. The Mandalorian. We're just going to keep looking for anything interesting. The Galaxy and the Galaxy Scout. I actually love the Galaxy Scout skin. Yo, I actually love how he upgraded the gear specialist. I think it is so sick. Look at the hat and everything and the blue. It just matches so well. The Heim. So it looks like we're now in the legendary skins. Oh my gosh, boys. He actually does have so many skins, though. The Midas. He does have fully golden Midas as well. The Midas Rex. Oblivion Oppressor. We're just gonna keep going through these guys. The Sentinel. Serana Spire Assassin. Tempest. The Bone Boss. This is actually a pretty funny skin. I honestly wish I had it because I would definitely wear this in game a lot more. Obviously, if I had it. And the Bone Ravage is actually so sick as well. Honestly, this should be called like the Skull Set or something like that. I think that would be a great name for this. And I hope they add more skins like this into the game where it's the Skull Trooper. I think it's super cool. The Bunny Wolf, Kemi vs. Chick, Caster, Katrina. Obviously, guys, we are in the Epic Skins. Epic Skins are probably my favorite color skins. Dr. Sloan, Dominion, Double Agent, the Dread Fade, another super dope skin. But it looks like this guy actually bought a lot of skins. Obviously, he is an Epic employee, though. The Fish Skull. The Fish Skull looks a lot like the Bone Boss. They're honestly, like, identical. Like, literally, guys, they're the same skin, I swear. The Flare Flow. Yeah, he did actually buy a lot of item shop skins, obviously, bro. This guy must have spent so much money on this game. The Man Cake, Mari Gold, Mave, Mecha Morty, Midnight Dust, Lloyd Marauder, Nightbeam, Ocean, Peekaboo, Peely, Pitch Patroller, Powder, Pulse. He also does have the Skull Squad Leader, another super dope skin. The Snake Eyes. I can't believe we're still in the epic skins, guys, and we're literally not even halfway done this locker tour. Like, this is actually nuts, boys. The Tuna Fish. This is actually another dope skin. He actually did upgrade a few of the styles already even though the new season just dropped the tropical punch zoe vega violet vix vox hunter we're just gonna keep going through these guys obviously i don't want to name every single one because that'll just bore you guys out the brilliant striker i actually love this skin honestly the brin uh, cozy chomps cryptic danger zone diamond diva the instinct iris journey versus hazard joy complex laguna lovely maverick metal mouth mesmer mika monks moxie Orin, party trooper it just keeps going guys we're literally still in the rare skins this is actually crazy nobel i actually really do like this skin as well i think it's super dope the surf rider surf witch survival specialist the suki another super dope skin i actually do have this skin on my account so it looks like we are now in the uncommon skin so he has yellow jacket yuki zadie relay ranger scarlet commander scuba crystal sergeant green clover shadow enforcer slingshot we're now getting to the bottom of this list we got the spirit champion trinity trooper vintage ramirez and to end it off we got the whiska skin Yo, this was actually such a stacked skin locker. Okay, guys, so to end off the locker tour, I want to get a quick little glimpse of all the emotes he actually has. We're just going to do a quick little scroll. Oh my gosh, wait, this guy actually has so many emotes as well. Yo, I actually love the dribbling emote. I think it is so sick. This locker was actually so stacked, guys. Okay, guys, so my final rating on this Fortnite account is going to be an 8.5 out of 10. I'm not going to lie, guys, this is probably one of the most stacked lockers I've ever seen. But the only reason he's not getting a 10 out of 10 is because he didn't have any OG skins. And if he actually did have OG skins, this would have been the best account I've ever seen. But yeah, my final rating is an 8.5 out of 10. If you guys want me to review your Fortnite account for next video, DM me on Twitter. I'm putting it on the screen right now.